welcome to the first ever episode of Paradise. Paradise is Mint Potion's stream about uh, tabletop gaming. Primarily... Are you muted? Are you muted? No, no, sir. Really? I am on. You're on, on, huh? Are we having technical difficulties? No, I don't think so. Okay. Is the sound just way down? This is great. Who knew? I don't know. Sorry, everybody. We may be having technical difficulties already. But Maybe speak a little louder. Hello. Hello. Hello there. Hi. I don't know if you guys can hear us. We'll wait for a sec, see what's going on. I can hear myself out there now. Can you hear me? Yes, yes I indeed. can. All right. Okay. Cool. I'm going to cool. close this. Awesome sauce. There we go. Doors closed. We're locked in yes, here. Yes, indeedy diddle. There's what no way we, out. What There's no way out. Well, it's just welcoming everybody to Paradise, which is uh, Mint Potion's new stream about tabletop gaming. Um, right now, we're focusing uh, heavily on Warhammer 40,000 because it's one of our favorite tabletop games. It's also one of the most popular tabletop games. Um, and also, uh, Paradise is the rebranding and the relaunching of a, sh of a stream that we used to do called Arts and Cracks, which was all about the, um, the hobbying side and the, the artistic side of, of uh, playing uh, tabletop miniature war games. Um, and we're moving away from that. Um, that's definitely, we're definitely going to be showing off models that we work on. We're definitely going to be showing stuff like that. Um, but uh, this, this stream is all about playing tabletop games. So we're starting with, with one of our favorites. Um, and as I said, one of the most popular, which is, which is Warhammer 40,000. So today, um, Preston, my cohort. Yes, sir. Staying golden and playing, playing Warhammer with me. Yes. Um, uh, is playing the Tau. And I am playing the Imperial Guard, nay, Astra Militarum. That was a rebranding that, that the Sue Happy company that makes this game, who, who I, I, I do love and admire, but nonetheless, um, they um, uh, rebranded a lot of their, their generically named um, intellectual property um, in order to, um, to protect it, for, uh, in order to protect itself from, from oh. people suing it. You know, these were originally called, this faction was originally called the Imperial Guard. Um, as you can see, they're the human faction, and they're, they're, they're pretty generically um, uh, designed. Um, forgive the uh, less than super impressive paint job. This is something I did when I was about 12 years old. Um, uh, so yeah, um, uh, these are the more generic humans, so they had a generic name. And I'm just sort of geeking out about that. that when did change. you uh, start playing? Uh, I was in seventh grade, so I was about 12 years old. Oh, wow. What brought you into it? Uh, a friend of mine. Um, a friend of mine, uh, my best friend. Um, he loved this game. His dad got him into it because he was a, a practical special effects artist. So he would work as someone who would make, um, um, you know, uh, latex masks and latex prosthetics and, and work with rubber and, you know, just be an all-around mechanic for, mm. um, for feature films and stuff like that. So he found this game that required you to, to build and paint stuff as, as well as play it. Um, so uh, he's now a, a 3D animator and teaches, uh, he's actually the head of the program at the New York Film Academy, oh, wow. um, where that same friend is now in graduate school. Oh. Um, he's in school for game design, much like I am. Um, cool. And yeah. you started with the uh, Astro Militarum? I started with the Space Marines. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. No, I I, when that. I was young enough, I was a snot-nosed kid, and my parents were buying me toys, or so they thought. Now that I'm, now that I'm a grown man, I make my own decisions, and I'm still playing with toys. They're just the ones I want to play with and the ones that I... I uh, finance myself. Um, uh, so yeah, speaking of that paint job and and us and when I me having done it when I was a kid, um, you can see that our models are in varying stages of being completed. Um, you know um, that that those black blurs you're seeing are just models that are covered with primer and nothing else, and some of them are painted. And mine aren't painted well because, as I said, I was 12. Um, this is our first ever show, and the way that we wanted to roll it out is by um, giving us something to build off of. You know. Oh. Um, we have no idea where exactly the show is going to take us or where we're going to take it, but that's part of why we wanted to do it. You know, Arts and Cracks, um, I had a lot of fun with, but um, we weren't able to do very much with it um, and we really hit a peak. And for that reason, you know, rather than keeping it going and, you know, telling the story past its logical end, we decided to rebrand it into this. Yeah, so and to be perfectly yeah. honest, not to, I'm oh, sorry please. to interrupt, but Always. to be perfectly honest, um, I like playing the game. Yeah. You know, like, oh, I yeah. mean, I, I mean, I enjoy playing. With army dudes, yeah, they're not always painted. They're not always in perfect condition, but I get to like pretend that I'm leading an army. Oh yeah, and flex my strategic and tactical brain. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's that's cool, and I'm I'm glad you're here to to help us out with this. Always, absolutely, so, the yeah. war master. Oh. <laughs> at your service um uh, yeah <clears throat> and uh this stream is not only going to be about this game but for now it is you know we want to we want to follow you know the spirit of, of arts and cracks and again it's a game we know and love 
In the future, though, we'll be playing lots of different types of games, and I'm very excited to say we're going to have tabletop game development be a part of the stream, Ooh. where I'm going to start showing some of the tabletop games I've made, some of the stuff I'm working on, and we would love to get submissions from people like you. Um, I racked my brain about how best to go about that, and I wasn't entirely comfortable with giving out the address of the studio so people could mail us stuff and things like that, but I started getting involved with a uh, playtesting group um, um, at USC um, where I'm getting ready to transfer to for, for game development, and it occurred to me how important it is to just, to just have people you can playtest with that's more than just your nuclear family and your best friends. So, um, and that's, that's really what the playtest group I'm in is all about, and I realized that... Um, um, it's just having that extra handful of people. So that's something that I think I might be most excited about about this channel. So if you're a tabletop developer like I am and you realize how few people you really have to play test and you realize that's something that video game developers, which we also are, mm. um, you know, that's something we take for granted, which is that we can take a game at any level of completion, throw it up on the internet, people can play test the crap out of it, they can break it, and then you can you can do a lot of real substantial work for free online as fast as you can get it up and people can play it. Absolutely. You can't really, I mean, you can do that with tabletop games, but again, you're limited to however many people you know that are willing to play it. How many people love tabletop games as much as we do? Not that many, but, you know, we have, like, our nuclear family to stack on top of that. So I want to change that. I want this show to be a solution for that. I want this show to be a space where people can, um, can submit, you know, things like game ideas and if you're comfortable game design docs and then, um, um, you know, email it to, um, to one of our, our it's, mint uh, potion studio things. Studio at mintpotion.com, I believe. Studio at mintpotion.com. So you can, you can, uh, throw that there. Also, I think, um, I think, uh, Ben might also be the best one. So I think it's, okay. uh, Ben, I don't know if it's Ben Nix or whatever, but sure. It's Ben at uh, mintpotion.com. He's, to be honest, the most responsive. Yes, um, and uh, if you really need to, you can hit me up. Uh, it's uh, Flippy Monkey, like my show, uh, flippymonkey at gmail.com. Uh, so you can hit me up. And I can always forward to Steven. And if Steven's okay with giving you his email address, he would yeah. also do that. I understand that maybe you want a more official thing. So, Ooh. But, uh, yeah, we can totally, yeah. We can totally we can make we can, it work. Gary and yeah. Anya, what if? Uh, what That's if, a great point. What if instead of Warhammer 40K, we just get a bunch of army men and spray paint them different colors, get a P.O. box? That'll work. Yeah, I like you that know idea. what? A we P.O. Should, box yeah. is actually very smart. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Because what I what I was gonna what I was gonna lead to is that you know improvising you know uh, prototypes and making my own prototype material um, is something that I've done all the time. You know, um, um, with you know taking an existing game and trying to make my own version of it with just like random raw building materials. Mm. I was thinking you could send me your, you could send us, excuse me, your, um, uh, your game design doc, and then we could start making our own version of your play pieces or what have you um, to, to, to spare us all the complication of, you know, are we safe giving out our physical address and, you know, receiving stuff from people we haven't met and stuff like that. Mm. Um, P.O. Box might fix that. Um, however, I'm still happy to do that, you know, to, to try and bang out my own even rougher prototype of, of your prototype or your finished product. Um, product um but yeah so that's all in the future um and i can't can't be more excited about it but we'll talk more about What's that going on, on our Discord. table man? i know like that's What's in the future right now let me, let me adjust the camera so we oh, can always. see a little better oh wow sweet what is what is this we have camera action we going have, on here we have force powers and I we're think, being shy I think about them i think there's a you have force powers yeah. yeah i think there's a ben back there supporting us like crazy which is great yeah um of course i just picked one emmy and kind of flew with it so what that's great. All right, so Whatever I guess, is, I, guess I guess if you want to start on one yeah. side or the other and you can explain if there's anything totally. about the army I've put down, I can do a little explanation on that. Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why cool. don't you get us started and then I'll Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh so I have here in this general area, the towel. <laughs> um being overseen by the golden girls in that shot. That was wonderful. Yeah, see like well, I mean like, you know, oh wait, hold on. Hold on. Oh yeah. That, that's my butt. Yeah. Oh, okay, there we go. Yeah. No, so those are my gently. So I got my, my golden hips. girls here. Stay golden, guys. Oh yeah. Stay golden, man. Mm -hmm. Those are some good-looking ladies. Yeah, All absolutely. right, so over here we have uh, the Tau. These are their these these twelve dudes here are their basic foot soldiers. Mm -hmm. They're called fire warriors because they like to fire stuff like guns. Indeed. Um, they have like crazy range and a good. I don't think they have any AP. The rules have changed, so you'll go over that. Yeah, but yeah, like yeah. they have strong weapons. Mm -hmm. um, but they're just regular guys, man. They're not. They don't have really anything special. Um, then here, in this area here, these guys, we have the Pathfinders. Um, they don't have as much range. They shoot a little bit more, but their big deal is marker light. Mm -hmm. They have little laser beams that, like, 
they shoot at people, and then they, like, target lock, or they target something, and then the rest of the Tau army, including these guys themselves, actually, get a bonus to that, um, which is pretty cool, right? Yeah. Um, and it's really cool because the Tau, believe it or not, I learned this recently, mm. they have no depth perception. <laughs> Indeed. Yeah. So shooting things can be difficult when you don't know exactly how far away it is. Um, so, yeah, I'm not sure how they were able to build any of their machines with that problem, but there you go. Uh, these two guys, these gray guys right here, these guys are crisis suits. Um, yeah, these guys, they're crisis suits. And they're going to be hanging with their homie here. He's a crisis commander um, or the HQ or headquarters of mm -hmm. the army. Yes, indeed. Um, and they're going to be doing something called Manta Drop. Manta drop. Like, like a, oh, yeah. Okay, it used to be deep strike, but it's called yeah. manta drop now. Um, so that way they can just kind of plummet in from the sky yep. and shoot stuff. They're jerks. Um, yeah, they, they are. They come out of nowhere and they shoot me. Yeah, they are. And then this big dude right here is a ghost keel. Um, he's, like, stealthy and does a lot of, like, damage but not a lot of shots. Mm -hmm. um, he's an infiltrator, which means he gets to start within nine inches of the enemy and their territory, there's a whole bunch of rules with that. Wow, we're, cool. yeah, there we go. Look at this, this is nuts, cool. yeah. This is, this is what we call camera movement, guys. <laughs> camera movement. Um, so yeah, that's, that's these guys. Mm -hmm. um, and then all together, they're an army. Indeed you do. All right. Yeah, we're, we're, this being our first game, you know, we looked at all of our options and then for our first stream and just realized that we're gonna have a lot more fun if we just start improvising terrain and we'll talk about that in a second. We take um, the armies that we have and use what, what um, this game calls open play, where you literally just sit down with your friend and then decide really roughly how big an army you want, what kind of rules you want. And, you know, yeah. it's, it's, it's the chillest way to play, and we were very happy to do it. Um, so speaking of, speaking of getting down and dirty and playing, so this guy, um, as, as I was saying before, is uh, part oh, of the Imperial Guard. Oh, here we go. Oh, super cool. See? See? Yeah, um, get, so my, my army are real. not right. some, some poor suffering of lack of depth perception aliens with super special abilities and technology. They are the common, the common foot soldiers, the common incredibly brave souls facing the alien hordes. So I have my, again, from when I was all of 12 years old, um, built but unpainted um, and not deburred um, uh, tank. Um, if you're wondering what deburring means, that's it's where you clean up all the rough edges and stuff that the manufacturer leaves. Oh, um, okay. um, and that's Ooh, also, look at that. We're getting like these know, really like, they're almost like kind of, our I'm, drone, I'm just letting our, you know. Our drones flying around and coming in and yeah. out really nicely. Yeah, I that mean, was that's, totally worth the money. Thanks, everybody. It's, I mean, that's, a, that's yeah. the money shot, right? Donate there. to our Patreon. That's, that's, it, that's, right how we buy our, that's how we buy our drones. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Um, but yeah, um, I spent most of last show um, actually ma letting my OCD go wild and creating an absolute um, hell project for myself out of deburring uh, the biggest, most expensive model I've ever bought, which is going to be great when it's done. But um, um, but yeah, I really did. I was there to be the commentator mostly as I was gently scraping apart my models. But yeah, no, we're keeping it really simple today um, so we can just get in the action and, uh, and show you guys a game. And then we're going to build from there. We're yeah. going to have, you know, not improvised terrain. We're actually going to be making our own and buying stuff from Games Workshop and painting it up. All of everything you see before you is yeah, going to get so finished. So and let's indeed. This terrain is uh, is packing material. Oh yeah. I can't remember what Mint Potion ordered. I think um, it was your off-road scooter. Oh yeah, it was the scooter that the 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 scooter Jake Jake got me this awesome swag tron mm -hmm. for my birthday because he's yeah. just a baller. Oh yeah. And then he wants me to be a baller, so now we can be yeah. baller together. And you unfortunately, can, I yeah, you're gonna go riding together. Yeah, we have to soon, actually, because like if I don't, I'm I think he's just gonna he's <laughs> just gonna be like I'm never speaking to you again. And it's like I know I'm an idiot, but anyway, so I took these and I like I like tore them up. Perfect. Right. And so now they become terrain. Mm -hmm. I don't remember which way that was. I assume this way. It's all great. Um, yeah. And like that's kind of how I've like I roll with this because honestly, like you just need stuff. Exactly. Yeah. No. I mean, this is this this reminds me of we're we're not developing anything today, you know. Um. But but um. This definitely makes me feel like development where where you just you find raw material from all the stuff around you and throw it down. Next week, things are going to be uh, closer to finished. And then the week after that, we're going to grow from there and grow yeah, and grow and grow. Slightly, slightly better, like exactly. we do with everything at Min Potions. Absolutely. Just a little better every day. Yes, indeedy doodle. Um, but without further ado, now that we've explained everything that you see before you, mm. um, now we're actually going to play. We're going to wow. get to the heat of the meat. 
All cool. right. So first things first, um, we roll off. Okay. Um, for those of you who roll were with the us table. for... Off the table? Should I get on the table? Oh, you're <laughs> talking about <laughs> dice. Okay, let's do that. All right. Good one. That was good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Genuinely me, didn't see that coming. Let game. me put down the, the main camera a bit. I'll, I'll lower Super that a cool. bit. So that way we get a little better angle here on the main, main deals. Yes, indeed. <clears throat> oh, cool. That's the edge of the TV that we're looking at you guys at, at stuff with, so just deal. Cool. All right, cool. That's fine. That actually looks really good. Yeah, right? Normally, that super wide lens gives us more problems than it's worth, but that oh. actually looks really nice. Right? That looks pretty good. Yes, I mean, indeed. You know, mm -hmm. it's kind of wall eyed. That's Like, that's it's a little fine. bent, but that's all right. We're yeah. good there. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. So, um, we begin. Um, uh, today we're going to talk a lot about how this edition is different than other editions because that's just my experience um, amongst all the things that I do in a day. Um, thank you. In my daily life, um, I donate my time at my local game store, teaching people how to play this incredibly complicated game. That's actually how I became um, a teacher, was um, uh, uh, teaching people this extremely complicated game. So most of the people who, um, uh, who, who have talked to me on social media, including our Discord and um, uh, and our old show and the store that I work at are getting into this game after after um, uh, playing previous iterations of the game. Um, so um, we're going to be <laughs> talking about that um, as we go. Um, so first things first, um, what do we, do? we begin the same way, which is we roll off. Okay. You get to die, I get to die, we roll it. So five. Beat that. Five. Oh, you didn't. We re-roll. Two. Four. four. Okay, cool. What does that mean? So, that means that you um, get to deploy first. Um, but I get, okay, now do I deploy the whole army? No. Okay. That means that you, that you will get to deploy first, but that right now, for the mission that, that we're playing, um, um, I get to pick, I get to divide the table. So this is actually really powerful. This is a really, really um, subtle addition to this game, which is just that now that since we both know what each other's army is, and that's never a secret, that's always open, which is you always know what army you're going to be playing, you can play to your own strengths. So um, uh, you've got the coward army. I'm just going to say it. No, it's I'm true. I do have it. a coward you've army. Got the coward I army. do. You know, yeah. that's what happens when you're nearsighted. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry. You have no depth perception. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, um, so um, you're, you're, you, by Coward Army, uh, we mean that he sits back and fires from long range. So I could, if I didn't have exactly the same shtick for my army, um, I could play to my strengths. And I could say, okay, we're going to start going lengthwise this way. And mm. it's going to be really short and bloody and favors close combat troops. But That's I don't have that kind. Good thing you didn't bring orcs. Yeah, exactly. Um, so I'm just going to cut the table in half this way. So this is, this is potentially really powerful, depending on, on your opponent. So that's step two, which is that um, the guy who loses the roll off gets to sort of, you know, like I, I look at it like cutting the deck. You know, mm. you get to you get to pick the table halves. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cool. Um, so from here, oh, and um, um, normally um, one would roll for different objectives and things like that. Today we're just going to be tr trying to kill each other. Mm -hmm. So if mm -hmm. you if mm -hmm. you're familiar mm -hmm. with the game and you know that um, um, and you know the exact procedure for the mission that I'm talking about, we're deviating th from that a little bit just so we can get to it. Um, so. Now, um, um, you set up your units, um, and we alternate. We go one oh, right. at back and forth, a time. Back and forth, okay. back and forth. Back and forth. All right. Now, I'm not, normally we'd like clear the table and stuff and have it be totally clean. Mm. Um, that's an interesting shot. Um, but at the same time, um, I think we're both set up um, the way that we are. Um, go ahead. Yes, oh, indeed. So oh. Really nice, we missed it. That's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Um, but yes, um, <laughs> and it goes back. <laughs> All right, cool, 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 cool. Um, but yeah, no, um, <laughs> everything's set up mostly the way I would have it, and I can tell because I'm familiar with your army the way that you would have it, so we can just get to it. Okay. So yeah, um, go ahead and fine tune everything. Um, but I set everything up so that we don't have to clear everything, it takes too much time. Okay, um, so go ahead and place one of those things where you would like it. Okay, so, um, I'm gonna take my uh, two crisis suits. Cool. And put them in deep strike. Okay. Cool. Or manta drop, I believe it's what it's manta called. Manta drop, yeah. These do, do, guys. Do, do. And I'm just going to put them <laughs> off here under. You can, oh, you can see it on the other screen. I'm just going to put them right here. Cool. And there you go. Very cool. So they're going to go there. Mm -hmm. And then uh, Steven will explain what happens after we're done deploying. Yes, indeed, he doodle. Oh, he gets to yeah. put him wherever he wants, which is really powerful. He gets, the, he gets to uh, uh, just, just place them on the board. Wherever he darn well pleases and, and blast my faces off. And it's not fair. It's not fair. But um, they're really expensive for that reason. How many tanks are over there? Three. Okay. Go ahead. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, maybe <laughs> it's kind of fair. Yeah. Cool. So um, I get to play something. Um, and we simply need to oh. be the tape measure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Here, let me, let me pull this out. Yeah. 
No, I, it's I just the that we the need to be uh, 12 inches away from um, each other. So this is a four-foot table? Uh, five foot. foot, 11 inches. Okay, so they, we'll call it six. All right. So there just needs to be a, a, a one-foot gap in the middle here. Okay. So from one foot to, I'm sorry, two feet to three feet. Right, we'll use that's dice just to mark that. So. Yeah. So here's, that's the center, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, so, oh, wait, no. Yeah, 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 this is cool. the center. Okay, cool. Full cool. cool beans. Cooler beans could not be found. Uh, cool. Dead. So that's where I want that guy, just right behind that big block, out of the way. But he's a close-range killer, so he's just ready to kill stuff. Nice. Um, so, cool. Um, go ahead. Okay, uh, I'm going to take my Crisis Commandor. Command Commandor. Commander give up. Is that what All you're right. saying? Uh, I like that option. Commander, Commander run away. Hmm. Um, and I'm going to put him in Deep Strike. Cool. So there you go. Well, then. Um, just now, I'm not going yeah, yeah. to lie here. Yo. I, I did watch a few battle reports. Of course you did. And uh, when, when you have Deep Strikers, it's kind of mm -hmm. good to play with when you put deploy them. So you can see what your enemy is doing. Yeah, definitely. Right? So... I'm, I mean, I'm not gonna, you know, I'm not gonna fib. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm using this as an example. Mm -hmm. um, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna try and kill you. Yeah, in this basically, war game. Yeah. it's it's gonna be bloody murder. Why does it feel like you have way less over there? Hmm? You have like way less space over there than doesn't it look like? It does. It's okay. It's fine. I think, no, I uh, like asymmetric boards. It's cool. Okay. Yeah. So I think I am gonna place my guy hither and yonder. Hither, hither. and yonder. Cool. So go ahead and place. All right. Um, I am going to place my pathfinders. Cool. Uh, right here. Behind here. Coward. Yep. Um, because you don't want, as Tau, you don't want anybody to ever see you. Um, and actually, since we don't have blast templates anymore, I could keep them close together. There you go. Yes, you can. All right. So that's those dudes. Yeah, this game used to have actual like physical templates that you would mm. move around and like hold over over a number of units, mm -hmm. um, and then that many people would be hit. But uh, they get rid of it. It was fun. The in incredible amount of anger that that produced. Just like, no, what are you talking about? This guy's under it. No, it's not. What are you talking about? Um, but it was too. Um, it wasn't accurate enough, so they got rid of it. Mm. But the amount of derision and aggression that came out of it and entertained me endlessly. Um, anyways. Um, I'm going to put my other guy here. This guy's my HQ, by the way. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. What's his, so is he, does to, he have a he's name? He's just Tank Commander. Oh, he's, he's Tank Commander. He's just okay. Tank Commander. Okay. Um, so, yeah. Um, uh, yeah. He's the guy with the pointy hat. That's how you know he's in charge. Nice. Super cool. Yep. Yeah, you can move stuff in the little room. Exactly. Oh, yeah. Exactly. Definitely. No, today we're here to be as chill as absolutely possible. Absolutely. I'm here to test out a bunch of different weapons and see how my favorite units go. And then we're going to do tear lots your heart of different out stuff. And eat your soul. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's, <laughs> right. that's literally what we're here to do. So go all ahead right. and place. All place right, all right. I'm going to move my, my, my fire warriors. And we're going we're gonna to do the most brave thing we can. We're just going to hide differently behind this, um, this little styrofoam, this wall of ruinous doom. Hmm. Um, I do want to point out the cover now works differently. You have to be in or on something, but right. there, there's always the matter of you can't shoot something that you can't see. Right. So this game uses what's called literal line of sight, where if you're a player, you actually get down on the table and look through your model or draw an imaginary line um, between your model and uh, the opponent. So if you can't see anything as you literally get down and squat... Yeah, you can't see anything. You, well, you can you see up. a gun. Maybe you could disarm one of them. Yeah. <laughs> That doesn't count. If oh, I want okay. to disarm it, I just grab it and give it a twist. That's um, true. No, um, <coughs> um, weapons and like antennae and banners and stuff don't count. It's okay. uh, torso, head, legs, and head is what you need to draw a line of sight oh, to. Okay. Cool. And, if and now it's, it's yeah. up to you, sir. Yeah, yeah it is. You're the next guy. Yeah, it is. You're the next cool. Guy. So your your HQ, which is always which is always um, worth more victory points when you kill. Because um, that's that's really um, the point of this game is obviously to kill your opponent, but it is a victory points game. Hmm. Um, so your HQ is is off um, off table. At the off moment. table. Okay, cool. Yeah. This one's mine, just because you and I both have a lot of units that look similar. Mm -hmm. I just want to make that really clear. Okay. But this is this is the warlord. Yeah, the guy standing up. Yeah, exactly. The only brave one. There. Well, pointy no, that hat. guy's pretty brave. But yeah. Pointy hat. Pointy hat. Yep, yeah, pointy hat. No, gotcha. he's got a tri corner okay. hat, and you know he's fighting for the humans. He it's it's he is he is important. Um, but yeah, man. Um, so yeah, um, this is a victory points game. Um, you get a point for killing an entire unit. So okay. not, not one particular model, unless, um, it's in the book that 
that uh, one model is a unit. So like you would get a point for taking out each of these tanks, but you only get a point for taking out all the models and this blob of guys. And same deal with yours. Monsters. All right. Yes, indeed. Um, cool. So I'm just going to stand these guys up. You don't have to wait for me to do that. This, this is where they're going. So go ahead and pick another uh, place another unit. Okay. Uh, now this guy is an infiltrator. Okay, cool. So do I place him now or do I wait until you're done? No, I place That's him now. You. Yeah, you can. And I have um, to do it within nine. It has to be, he has to be more than nine inches mm -hmm. um, from an enemy unit, but he can be in line of sight. Yes, he can. He can be. Yes, so, can. Um, as 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 brave as I am. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, he's <laughs> going. He's going right there. Super he's cool. He's going there. Okay. Yeah. So there you go. Cool. Which is actually right on the line, which is kind of silly. Yeah, it to is. Even <laughs> have an infiltrator like that, but okay. Yeah, you could also wait and have him. Um, and have him um, off the board just like your other guys, but rather than deep striking, he'd be infiltrating. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. And that could be, it used to be this really awkward system where you, you can only deploy things not the way you wanted, but but um, it, you'd have to roll a die, and then you could see if they'd come in, and then, um, and, then it, and it would never be on a turn that you could control. It would just be whenever the dice said, and it was never your first turn. They did away with all of that, the, all of that convoluted, unfun stuff. At the end of your turn, any one of your turns, you can just say, okay, here he is. Have fun with that. Nice. Cool. All right. Okay, cool. Sweet. Cool. cool. So I'm all deployed. Are you all deployed? I am all deployed. Oh, my God. Let's start playing. Let's cool. do it. Now. All right. So let me get the tape measure because we're going to need that for yeah. actually playing Everything. the game. Oh, yeah. Um, and then how do we now, how are we going to start this, 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 cool. bad, this, this amazing Let's adventure start. of guns and blood? Guns and blood? Guns and blood. I love it. It sounds like. The lazy version of Game of Thrones, right? Just like swords and blood and guns and blood. Yeah, guns yeah. and blood. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, um, just a dude who sits on phases. like the throne, and then somebody walks in and shoots him, and then he takes his place. Yeah, exactly. And then somebody else walks in and shoots that guy. Yeah. And then takes his place. And then there's a really smart one who comes along, and as soon as he takes the throne, he looks really nervous. Then he gets killed. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. He's, he's he's kind of seeing a pattern. Oh yeah. 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 All right. Anyway, that's <gasps> my version of, of yeah. guns and guns and. Blood. Yeah, All now right. someone from something called Mint Potion, or is that like Pint Motion? But Pint, mint Potion. Mint, says, mint potion that's can we put mint, uh, sunglasses around your belt as if you're looking at if you're going to look at me that way? Um, uh, if if you're going to look at me that way? Like oh, you know, you know, I wish, I wish, I but wish. unfortunately, I wish. Unfortunately, this is just you know, this yeah. is what happens when you're blessed. Yeah, um, uh, only when you're one of our patrons. Bubba we do that Fett. For you? What did Gary was saying? Bubba Fett. You, dude, you could paint Fett. Bubba Fett if you want. You could paint and Bubba actually, Fett whatever color you want. As a real quick side note, there's Yo. a lot of like Star Wars and other themed games Dope. too that are tabletop. So if you guys like really, really, really want us to get stuff, yeah, we'll let try. Us know. But also remember, if you become a patron, we'll be able to get that stuff. And yeah, as as like a thing, mm -hmm. you know, we get enough patrons. Pa patrons coming in then we can have like prizes right so like if you want to get into warhammer either fantasy or 40k mm -hmm. or any games we get into we could probably like buy one and then ship it to you if you win yeah i don't know we could do like a random draw from our sure. chat or something like that which I actually i have that. no idea how that works yeah no we're that's we one should of the explore things, that yeah that we're that we're working on as well outside of this stream but yeah. just one of the things that mint potion yeah um and it's as low as a dollar a month yeah, like yeah, that's yeah. like way more than than fantasy. That's Warhammer. amazing. Fantasy war like fantasy football. That's called Blood Bowl, by the way. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's no, Blood that's, Bowl. Fantasy. This game is British, and they um um that this no sooner do I say that we get our viewership cut in half. Uh, this game is British, and uh, they they're making fun of Americans by having this high fantasy version of American football, mm. and the actual subtitle of the game is fantasy football. Hmm. The ultimate game. Hmm. But not blood. No, I know what you're saying, Gary, and I just thought that that was too funny. Like, for when I was a kid, I was just like, wait, are they making fun of us? And then they rebooted the game, like, two years ago, and it just says right on there, fantasy football. But I do see what you're seeing, Gary. Hi, Gary, and by the way, it's always good to see you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, um, dude. Hello. Uh, uh, what if we had fantasy Warhammer like fantasy football? I don't know anything about fantasy football. Um, well, so it's like, no it's like you pick, like, uh, I was about to say characters. I mean, they kind of are. It's D and D for jocks. I know that. Basically, you pick like players, and then based on their how well they do in combination with other players you've picked, mm -hmm. then like you gain points or you get your score goes up or something. Cool. And then you win. 
But like, if you were gonna do that with Warhammer, I would say it would be more like either you pick the tournament players, mm -hmm. but that'd be just straight gambling, <laughs> or even better, actually, which would be really cool for fantasy Warhammer in the 40, 40k. But yeah. you know, in, yeah, in, yeah, the, yeah. in the fantasy football sense, yeah, yeah. would be like picking a unit. Dope. Right, like you, like right now, what do you think the strongest unit in Warhammer is? Mm -hmm. And then like you would you would, you know, follow that unit through, let's say, the official tournaments. Right. And then based on how well it did, you would, like, move up in amongst mm -hmm. your peers who are also playing. Super cool. Yeah. It was just weird because, like, you can't get an autograph from, like, a yeah. Ghost Keel or a Riptide. Gotcha. Yeah. Anyway, what's going on? Cool. Yeah, that's so what yes, I was thinking, right? See? Super cool. That's actually yeah, an interesting that's idea. That's a very good idea. Yeah. yeah. This is why I'm so glad we have this, we have this stream back was because, you know, Ideas like this don't often get bounced around tabletop games. So thank you, Garyan. That's that's awesome. Um, pick up the rockster. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, that's super cool. Um, and I'm sorry to hear that you had to quit your job, Garyan. Yeah. Wait, he had to wait. What? Yeah. I had to quit my job since my buddy got in a that's spat right. with his dad and doesn't have a car anymore. That sucked, man. Dude, that's not cool. That's not cool at all. What do you? I mean, like, you just don't have a car. Is that the only thing? That sucks, man. It does suck, yeah. Um, and you probably like Uber would probably cut too much into your pay, right? Like, yeah. huh? Yeah. I don't know. I mean, like, can you bike there? Oh, you don't drive at all. Is it close enough for you to ride a bike? Oh. I'll have to wait like twenty-five minutes before that gets to him. <laughs> that sucks. Uh, I look. I look, took the job to help him pay for oh. gas costs of going. It's 100. Is that all? What? It's, it's 100, 100 miles, miles away? It's only 100 miles. My God. Wow. I'm sorry, man. That yeah, sucks. That sucks. We're happy to have yeah. you. Absolutely. My job is here and I live here. Like, mm. kind of like all the time, which is awesome. Yeah. It's like I just wake up and I come here and I work and then I, then I go to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Super cool. Yeah. So yeah. I have no life really outside of this place, which is not That's too shabby. Not it keeps me focused, right? Yeah, yeah. So, you know. Yeah, I'm not yeah, sure yeah. why we only have one viewer because I mean, if you look at the screen, what else do you need to see? You got War Army, Warhammer dudes, yeah, a table and mm -hmm. our bellies, our bellies. You, you got you got all four golden girls, all four golden. If you girls. stand at the right height, yeah. There you go. We expect you to blow out your knees to keep that frame. By the way, I'll oh do the same God. for the Ant Man. Yeah, I can't. I'll probably Definitely. pass out. Um, <laughs> okay, cool. So yeah. let's let's get into it. So, what yeah. are we doing? So what you get doing? to choose right. since you won. You get to choose who goes first. Um, some people want the extra control of going second. Some people say, no, I want to go first. Hmm. Um, and then I get to what's called seize the initiative. You go, uh, or I rather, I get to roll a d6 to see if I go first. If I steal uh, the ability to go first from See, me. this is tricky here, because like, I can yeah. do a bunch of stuff. Oh, yeah. Those tanks are kind of spooking me. As well they should. <sighs> As well as they should. Well, I think I will go first. Okay. And then you can seize, try to seize the initiative. Uh, which, you know, that's always a possibility. So, yeah. you know, that does make me a bit nervous. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, and then we'll start this, this bad boy up. Do it. Cool. All right. So you have to roll to seize, yes? Yes, indeed. So this is only on a natural six. Don't fall down and seize. Just, just. Yeah. A one? Seriously? Oh. Seriously? Yeah. Oh, well. It's all right. All cool. you had to do is have it roll two more times, and it would have been a six. Well done. It's like um, saying two wrongs don't make a right, but three lefts do. They do, actually. They do, as a matter of fact. All righty. So... Now I have to do what? I have to just yeah. start moving so, dudes? Yes, and... indeed. This game has six phases now. So uh, really, yeah. they, they didn't add. They just they consolidated a lot of the convoluted stuff in okay. each phase and actually made separate phases. And believe it or not, it goes a lot faster for it. All right. Um, so the first phase is the movement phase. So you're still just moving your guys around up okay. to the movement value that's on the sheet. Okay. So um, what's your movement? It should be about five. Oh uh, yeah, uh, yes, it's five. Oh yeah, five or six. Oh, that's right. It's not six anymore. It might not. Wow, be. I'm a terrible human being. You're not a terrible right. human being. You're <clears throat> a terrible towel man. That's true. You're a dirty blue alien. That's true. Get it right. All right. So will it tell me? Garyan tweeted. What did you tweet, Garyan? I've never tweeted. Does it tell me anywhere? Is there a page that tells me like how much they? Oh, here we go. Yeah. No, that's oh, not that's a point, point value. No, it'll be in the data sheet. So. Uh... Uh, now point, point values. See now, now we're also learning how to use this like use the Warhammer yeah. gear. Cool. It'll be the little M. Oh, that's here in here in okay, here. so that means I actually have to go to the unit itself. Yeah. That's interesting. Okay. Uh, ethereal cadre, fire blade, dark strike team. Okay. Yeah. Movement. Six inches. Hey. Super cool. That's cool. Okay. <laughs> so. 
they're not going to move anywhere. Um, <laughs> <laughs> all yeah. right. Pathfinder team. Breacher team. Breacher team. Fruit Shaper. Tweeted to come stealth, watch. Cool. Crisis by Ghost Keel, Riptide. <laughs> Pathfinder team. Mm -hmm. You move seven inches. Um, oh, that's fast. Yeah. That's super cool. They're not moving anywhere. Guys, we have to uh, change the battery real oh, quick. Oh, do we? I'll take the opportunity Wait, to do that Wait, why did it turn off? Quick. No, no, no. They're actually... Really? No, no, it's on. Excuse me? It, it's plugged actually directly in. So we're going to end the camera still on right there. Oh, it is? Yeah. Yeah, it must have just made a weird noise. Hmm. That happens. So, um, and then... For a second. I don't know what that... Means, but yeah. And we have the second battery there regardless. Right, right. Okay. Super cool. Yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah, it's like this thing like has a through, so it'll just power through instead of charge anything. Cool. Beautiful. Yeah. Love to know why we weren't using that more often. But no worries. Oh, we were. What was I saying? All right. <clears throat> so, uh, okay. my, what am I doing? Okay. <laughs> so let me think here because, see, I almost feel like I shouldn't really move much. Totally. Oh, because... I do that all the time, which is just thus concludes my movement. Yeah, first. I think, which is really terrifying and bad, um, because then I took first turn for no reason. No, not at all. Um, that's fine. Well, that's all right. You, you know, you're, you're being nice. Oh, you know what I could do? Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, okay, what I could do got? that. Okay. So what I'm thinking Whoa, is... Oh, that's right. I might deep strike I right here. It. Yeah. Or move this guy here. Go for it. Or both. Yeah. And try to take that guy out. Don't, that's a terrible idea. Don't do that. No, oh, no, okay. that's awesome. No, both of those things are really good ideas. Okay. Do okay, you know if okay. this guy has something called Fly? Which, um, oh, if good, you're, good if you're a point. veteran to this game, um, they did away with unit types. Um, now, instead that they have, they have words, they have, they have this mechanic called keywords, where when you have a specific keyword, you get this, uh, these different abilities, and then a lot of those are, um, are what um, would come with a specific unit type. So I like it. It feels like a raw. Okay, guys, we're rebooting. The, we're re not rebooting. He does have the fly nice. special rule. He has cool. A, he's a battle suit, monster, jetpack, fly, XV ninety five. Cool. Ghost kill battle suit, gym. Nice. Right. A, yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That's okay. Awesome. So now that means I can move. That means you can move up to your movement value. Um, it, but it means that you can move over stuff like it's not there. So fly oh, right, replaced right, right, what right, jump right, pack made. Right. So let me ask you this, yes, Senor. See, si. what if I decide to move up here? Would you Go have an it. issue with that? No, not at all. If you can physically place a model on top of a piece of terrain, okay, then you're fine. So right. normally the way it works is you have to measure, and this game uses, you know, um, yeah, a tape for, measure for, for that for, reason. For, for, yeah, um, yeah. It uses, yeah. uh, you move a number of inches in physical space. So like if you have six inches of movement, okay, that's cool. You have to walk up to the base of it and also up to what looks like another four inches there. So most units don't have the movement. You just make yourself a nice big piece of terrain, um, and that normally takes care of it. But then some jerks like him get to fly up on stuff. So as long as you can physically place it, like the rules are built around don't break your stuff. If you can physically fit yeah, it yeah, yeah, and it's yeah, safe, yeah, yeah. go for it. Yeah, yeah. So you don't can totally break do your that. Stuff. Okay, cool. So yeah, I'm going to measure do. now. Go All for right, it. So this, I'm, I'm doing the top down thing, right? Mm -hmm. so this oh, is, you actually don't have to do that. Oh, I don't have to do yeah, that. Yeah, no. Oh, when it's just I directly. say over, yeah, that's, yeah, I did a bad job explaining it. No, no. If you have fly, you just treat it like the world is flat to you. You just land on top of it. So I'm going to, I'm going to put him in harm's way. Always. Because that's what. It's what military big scary else. robots do. Yeah, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna do that, and then uh, and then I'm gonna deep strike. There you go. Or wait, wait, wait. Oh, that's at the end of the turn. Oh, well, actually, no. Um, it's at the beginning of the movement it phase. It is the beginning of the movement phase. Yeah, so yeah. So I actually messed did up. Did something else. That's fine. All right. So technically, I shouldn't have moved yeah, that guy. Go for it. All right. No, today everything's getting started. It's gonna be as chill as could possibly be. You take as many mulligans and do as many shenanigans as you can. And I am going to do the same. Okay, and now for here, see now this is what's kind of tricky now. See, mm -hmm. I, I did do it, like I said, I did do a little, little bit of research. Um, Sweet. Now I have to be more than nine inches away, so I can't be exactly nine inches. Uh -huh. I have to be like nine and a quarter or a half sure. inch away. Um, that's like super important. Like yeah. I notice, like people are like, well, nine inches or two inches or whatever, uh -huh. and you know, or <laughs> eleven and a half. Yeah. Anyway, um, so yeah, so. <laughs> So you gotta you gotta make sure that you're like behind the line. Like it's like think of it as like the line of scrimmage in football. 
Sure. Right. You've mm-hmm. lost me already with your sport ball talk, but I think Okey I can figure dokey. it out. Yeah. So, you know, neutral zone infraction. Mm. Anyway. <laughs> um, so I'm going to take. You have to be behind the line for sure. <laughs> All yeah. right. So I'm going to drop homeboy here, right here. Mm-hmm. And he can fit on that. You know, I actually met someone whose family given name was actually Homboy. Homboy. Yeah. That's really cool. Yeah, no, I'm lying. I don't know anybody. Really? No, I just thought You had me funny. going there for a minute, <laughs> dude. Um, okay. And then, this is going to be really scary. I'm going to take the other crisis suit, and I'm going to put them. Oh, no, it's got to be from the closest unit, right? And this guy's close. For what? Well, because, like, like, I'm going to deep strike them, but I can't just measure from here. Oh, I yeah. From no, the closest totally. dude, right? Because, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. if I don't, that's terrifying. Mm-hmm. All right. <clears throat> so I'm going to take this dude, or these dudes, both these dudes, um, and we're just going to hang out, like, right here. Mm-hmm. And we're just going to try to, like, soften these two tanks in the front up. Probably not going to do much damage, mm-hmm. but we're just going to try to soften them up a bit. That's for sure. More than nine inches, and let me pull him back just a smidge. And there we go. So that completes my movement phase. Your movement phase. Yes. Cool. So, so after the movement phase, it's shooting time. Shooting uh, time. It's the shooting phase. Or actually, it's the psychic phase, but none of us have, have psychers. So I'm getting ahead of myself. Um, uh, yeah, normally uh, phase number two is the psychic phase. Where, um, because this game is, is, you know, set in the future, they try and distinguish themselves from their equivalent high fantasy games. So rather than calling them magicians or wizards or sorcerers, they call them psychers, um, where you generate spells and use them. And it's really cool. It's a really great layer of complexity of the game. Um, but that's something they do to add character to an army, and our armies don't have that. It's just not No, they have character. no character whatsoever. <laughs> uh, um, no, not at all. None, not um, at so all. we're skipping straight to the next phase, which is the shooting phase. Okay, so shooting phase... Yes, For crisis battle suits, mm-hmm. I'm going off of ballistic skill. Yes, indeed. Okay, and it's a four plus. Yeah. So ballistic skill, um, everything in this game revolves around a d6, um, and so that the result that you have to roll to see if you hit something is four or better. Okay. Now in this game, um, because being d6s, um, there are six sides to it. Four plus means a 50-50 chance, oh, okay. which is which is average. You know, yeah. you're a you're a skilled warrior. You can hit something um, uh, half the time. Half the time. Yeah. And you're gonna roll a number of a uh, d6 equal to the number of attacks you have. Okay. And that's gonna be under type. Oh, okay. So I have rapid fire one for the plasma Super rifles. Super cool. Okay. Um, and they are strength six, AP minus three. What's a d1? Whoa, that's awesome. AP minus three. Yeah, so damage is now a new thing in this game. Oh, so you're right. going to have a number of attacks uh-huh. equal to um, equal to uh, the the weapon profile, but for however right. many wounds you score, you do that many times damage. Oh. So if it's like heavy one, but damage three, if you roll you roll one die to hit, one die to wound, you're going to take three wounds off. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's not so there's some shabaroo. weapons that are just exponentially more powerful than they were, even though a lot of the numbers are the same. Which I thought was really elegant of them to do. They change um, um, uh, side duck phase. I like that, Gary. Oh, oh, oh. Side duck phase. Side duck phase. Yeah, yeah, yeah we yeah, don't yeah, have yeah. any psychers. We don't need them. We are going to make fun of them all day. Yeah. Stupid side duck. Yeah. Um, so. Um, <laughs> anyway, <laughs> what? So yeah, um, uh, that was one thing that I I conscientiously didn't tell you about because I thought it would be really great for our viewership who are learning the game. To have you um, learning along with them, because I that's oh, cool. yeah, cause yeah. I think you you really well represent most of the people out there, and especially most of our viewers, which is that um, they're people who play the game, which is why they're here in the first place. Yeah. But they're not they're not um, they're not aware of a lot of the new changes and stuff. Yeah, so yeah. I was yeah, actually yeah. really looking forward to you being like, wait, what's the D stand for? Right, and I was right. just like, yeah, dude, damn it, it's way cool. Okay. Um. Uh. Yeah, they changed one little number and then made the game understandable but totally, totally more substantial. Super nice. Cool. So you're going to roll however many... Um, so if it said uh, rapid fire Rapid fire one, one and it's... Uh, okay, so the range yeah. is 24 inches. Cool. So rapid fire means that you get to fire an additional shot, or um, twice as many shots, um, if you're within half range. So the oh. one would mean that he gets to make one attack, rolls one die to hit, one die to wound. Um, and we'll explain what that means, what each of those things mean as we go. Um, but you're in half range, so you get to do double. So okay. go ahead and measure. It looks right. like a foot. I'm only at the toe. I think like so. I think that's about a foot. I don't think it's an elbow. I think it's a foot. I mean, it. Yeah, it's a foot. 
Cool. That that's almost exactly yeah. a foot. You're actually you're being nice and you're measuring to the body of the hole. It's yeah. just the closest part of the model. Oh, the closest part yeah, of the so model. Yeah, so you're definitely at a foot. I mean, that's an even harder target to hit. You'd think I'd go for the body, right? I yeah. mean, yeah. <laughs> I and mean, you yeah. know, there you go. Okay. Yes, indeed. So um, so I roll. Yeah. So you roll two for two each. Dice. Yeah. For each one of these guys. So you're doing both. Is that one unit? This is one unit. Okay. Cool. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, that's exactly the way it works. You roll for everybody in the unit. Um, all together. Um, so yeah, so they both have the same weapon, so you're just right. gonna roll four dice because there are two guys. And it's gotta be attacks. four or because now four or better. Okay, yeah. so I'm rolling to hit right now. Correct. Okay. So, so the first thing to do is to to determine that if uh, your soldiers are hitting anything. So you do that by rolling a dice. Um, and he needs a four up. All right, here we go. Yep. Cool. Hey, I got three. Super cool. All okay, right, cool. So, so this guy we get rid of. Totally. Okay, yep. and then these we keep. So those were to determine All if right. your warriors actually hit. Now we're going to see if the shot landed and actually hurt him. Okay. So that means that's called rolling to wound. Um, okay. So now you compare the strength of the weapon you're using to the model's toughness. So what's Six. the strength? Six. Okay, that's, that's nice and powerful. Um, and my toughness is, and for those of you who are, who are um, like Preston, where you're familiar with the game, but not this edition of it, you know, that a lot of people have been coming out of the woodworks just saying, I hear this new edition is great, I gave up on it, I want to get back into it. Vehicles used to have this, this it now seems really complicated system of, you know, they had their own, like, you know, armor values, and depends on, like, where the models were on the table, and you did math, and, you know, which is, which is fun. It's part of the complexity that makes tabletop games great. Um, but they streamlined everything a lot. I now just have toughness like anything else. So we're going to compare the six, the strength of the weapon, to the toughness of, of this model. So it's six to eight. So six you, to eight, okay. Yeah, so exactly. So you're going to have to roll. Okay. Um, you're going to have to roll um, uh, five or better. Five or better? Right. So now, if, how do you come to that exactly, conclusion? Exactly. That's exactly the right question. Thank right. you. Um, if the, the value of the strength and the toughness are the same, mm -hmm. there's a 50 50 shot. So it's okay. like, yeah. And a D6, that's four up. That's four up. Okay. So if the, um, if the, the victim is stronger than the strength of the weapon, um, he's more resilient, and that's represented by you having a tougher roll to make, so that's going to be five up. However, oh. one of the biggest changes to this game is that now anything can hurt anything else. Right, right, anything right. Anything right, can right. hurt okay. anything else. It's okay. just a tough roll. Yeah. So if the strength, I'm sorry, if the toughness is double or more the strength of the weapon, okay. it's going to be a six. Oh, wow. Yeah, so because I'm tougher but only by, by two points, um, you just need a five up. So even if it's like way tougher, like, like yeah. let's say it's six and the toughness was like, 30. Exactly. It'd still be a 6 up? Absolutely. Okay. okay. Yeah, no, this game made, made little infantry guys way, way scarier. Oh. A little grot with a broken homemade pistol can actually hurt Sarah, actually hurt a big giant robot oh, nice. that he's not playing with today, but he no, has no, this no. massive scary unit called the Storm Surge um, that he affectionately named Serge, which Serge. I thought was one of the yeah. funniest things I've heard in a long time. Serge, Serge. Serge the Storm Surge. Huh? Um, so yeah, so these crappy little infantry guys can now take down these big behemoths, nice. um, which is one of the things that makes the game go faster. Cool. Um, so yeah, so go ahead and try and hurt me, sir. You okay, need five or so better. Five or better. Here we go. Mm -hmm. No, 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 no. Happens. It all bounced off. Super cool. Okay, so I got a one, two, and a four. In case people yep. are wondering, so that didn't work. Okay, no. that's cool. That's okay, cool. cool. And I all think right. you had so much fun there. Why don't you go ahead and do it again? All right. Yeah. So again. I got these uh, missile pods. Oh right. Here. Oh, those guys have a bajillion guns. I was looking, literally yeah, they, looking they, around they... the table, wondering. Yeah, they have no, a million weapons. Cool. It's kind of neat. Um, missile pods. Okay, so it's. Range thirty six inches, mm -hmm. assault two, strength seven, minus one AP. My phone turned off. <laughs> uh, D three. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. So that means so that's the damage value that I was talking about. So for every wound you score, you're gonna cause three wounds. I'm sorry. For every successful to wound roll you make, you actually take three wounds off. Oh. So if I those shots more get in, yeah, they're wow. they're nasty. All right. So. Uh, again, I will be rolling two or four. I'll be rolling four. Mm -hmm. And then these have to be four ups. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got one. You got one. I got cool. one. Okay, cool. So he got one. So if I can't, um, the shot might bounce off. And that's being represented by what's called an armor save. Um, I get to see if um, fate was actually kinder to me than you all along. So what's the AP on that? AP, the, uh, whether or not I get a save is, or what my save is, is well, determined it's, it's by the armor Well, it's strength value. seven. Yes. AP negative one. Okay, cool. Uh, negative one. There used to be, you know, again, this convoluted system of comparing numbers and, you know, doing the math in this game is great, but their system was their own invention. It was really weird. Now you just take that number. You said negative one. Yeah. So I just take the save that I have and it, it, um, it gets worse by one. So I have a nice, sweet, powerful save. I have, I believe, a three up save. 
Yeah, I have a three up save for these guys. So now it's going to be a four up save. Well, I haven't rolled the wound yet. Oh, I'm sorry. Right? I thought you just did. No, no, that was just to hit you. Oh, well then. Never mind. Oh, yeah. I only have one. Okay, so it's seven versus your eight. Correct. So that's what? Five up. Five up. Another five up. All right, let's see what we got here. No, oh, it's a one. God. Oh, okay. So those those guys shot. You know, they hit decent. It's just weapons yeah. just, you know, imp- oh, yeah. the Imperial armor, you yeah. know, it lives up to its name. Okay. Yeah. Okay. The so dude sticking his head out of the hatch and laughing at you. Yeah. I mean, you'd think I'd shoot that guy, but no. Oh, yeah. No. He's just like, what are you doing, clowns? <laughs> yeah. All right. So it's now. It's a lack of depth perception. It really is. Really, yeah. It really is. Um, all right. So I'm not going to try with that guy. Cool. All right. I have two fusion blasters oh, on God. him. Oh, God. Uh, strength eight, Those assault are one. Purpose built to ruin my day because uh-huh. they're anti vehicle, and that's what uh-huh. I love. Uh, <laughs> that's the right reaction, by the way. Uh, uh-huh. So it's strength 18. Oh, you are know what? Or no, no, no. no, no. <laughs> it's the range. <laughs> I love how you're like, wait, <laughs> are you serious? Yeah. Um, no, it's uh, range 18. Cool. Now, what's interesting is it says here that, hold on, it says it here melt the weapon. if the target is within half range of this weapon, Roll two dice when inflicting damage with it and discard the lowest result. However, it's 18, and I had to be more than 9 inches yeah. by default. So, so no. just by default, there's no way I'm going to be able to be half. Correct. See, that's kind of a neat little balance thing. Absolutely. Because I think a lot of Meltas are like, aren't they within 18 to 12 inches? They're or usually something? shorter than that. Really? I think that might that whole, that ga- I'm so glad you mentioned that because I did not think of that. Hmm. That whole game-wide stipulation of you need to be half range hmm. might have been what determined, for, for this type of weapon, might have been determined by um, just just Tau deep striking, mm, you know, because I mean, like you you have the sweet spot. Most mm-hmm. multi weapons are less expensive but shorter ranged, mm-hmm. or much better ranged and more expensive. Mm. You have an even across the board mm-hmm. for you. Everything's eighteen inches. Mm-hmm. That alone might have determined. Okay, deep mm-hmm. strike nine inches away. Yeah, uh, you know, maybe. <laughs> all right, it's all your fault. You I just know, throw right? wrenches and I'm just a terror. I just, I just, I'm, I'm very low when it comes to picking armies. I'm like, those guys are just always gonna win. <laughs> Which is so not true, but, you know, I'll live with that. All right, let's see. Oh, here we go. Commander. Okay, so the commander's ballistic skill is two up. Dope. Okay. So That's as good as any roll in this game gets. Right. Almost nothing happens automatically. You have to roll right. for it, but two or better is the best. Um, and he has target lock. Oh, of course Because I'm, I'm talking about support systems now. For sure. So um, the battle suits, not, they don't only have um, weapon dealies. Mm-hmm. But they also have um, special, like, systems that help them out, mm-hmm. right? Um, and these guys have, like, multi-trackers, but I didn't really move, so I don't really matter. Mm-hmm. Um, and this guy has a stimulant injector, I think. Wait, what did I write down? Hold on. I write these things. You got to write these things down, guys, because mm-hmm. it's really... Um, so, no, he has a shield generator. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, anyway... So he has a shield generator and target lock, of course, because it gives me an extra negative one to AP. So that's great. All right, so here we go. These have to be two ups. Ooh, I got a f- four and a six. Now, does do I get anything super slinky for... Super slinky. Yeah, do I get anything cool for just being a cool guy? You are a cool guy. Where is... Where, where is you get Garian? my friendship. Mine and Garion's friendship. Of course, of course. This is great. Thank um, you for being with us, Gary. Yeah, thank you very much. We appreciate it, dude. Like, it, it means a lot to us to be mm-hmm. able to have somebody watch us do our crazy Play stuff. Play with our dolls. Play with our <laughs> dolls. Okay. So, and he, so he hit with both. And the strength of the weapon is eight. And your toughness on those are eight. Eight. So it's going to be a four or better. Yeah. Okay. See, I'm learning quick here, guys. So here we go. We're gonna do try to try to get fours. We're gonna try to get double fours or better, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, we got two threes. Oh, oh you see how that, that works? Yeah. You see how it works? It's it's a you yeah. know it's this is a roll of the dice. All right, so um, that pretty much takes care of oh, homeboy yeah. there. Um, cool. he doesn't have any more weapons than that. I thought you. I mean, I could put like four on him but and be a death ball, but I just yeah. I figured we'll WYSIWYG this. You can see For that sure. he, you know. WYSIWYG is, uh, is a really long acronym. It's what you see is what you get. Yeah. Is that something that, that, um, uh, that happened a lot in this game that drove a lot of people nuts, which is just like, okay, I paid for this model and I built it, mm. but now there's a new book out for it and I want to try this other thing. Just pr- pretend, imagine, if you will, that this guy's completely different. And it drives a lot of gamers nuts 
Um, just because um, uh, Games Workshop, the developer of this, isn't in the business of selling magnets or pins, but it's actually very easy when um, when you've been doing this for a while mm. to just build things in with magnets and stuff like that. Or mm. Isn't this guy has some stuff that's magnet? Uh, yeah, his, his guns are magged. So yeah, yeah you cool. can pull those off. So yeah, so stuff like this, you know, where you can just, you can take stuff off and, and put magnets in it um, to make it interchangeable and stuff. So it's actually in the rules now about minimum unit strength. Like people were just like, okay, I've got my, my, my guys over here, but like I lost two of them. Just imagine that those dice are now, that squad's at full strength. Okay, cool, thanks. It's actually in like every main section of the rules. Mm -hmm. There's there's something called minimum strength. Just saying, if you don't have enough models to have a minimum strength unit, just include it anyway. Don't worry about it. Yeah, yeah. Just don't worry about it. Just yeah. play. Um, so they're they're literally putting it in the rules, which is just you know make it WYSIWYG. So I appreciate hmm. that. No problem. Um, okay, so now I have Mr. Ghost Keel here. Um, you know, I was thinking maybe I'd regret not moving these guys. But now that I see that I've completely failed all these roles, it's yeah. probably a good idea that you they hide. You dropped out of space with giant Gundam-like robots being driven by unimaginably powerful aliens and missed every shot. Yeah. I mean, yeah. you know, <laughs> it's basically like, uh, you know, I'm a bunch of stormtroopers, and uh, you're, the <laughs> you're the Rebel Alliance, so we're doing pretty good here, I think. All right. Every time you miss every <laughs> shot like this, I'm just going to slip a stormtrooper action figure <laughs> in your hand in the future, right? just like, hey. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah, basically. Yeah. Basically. Yeah, yeah. All right, and so I love what Gary said. Sorry, what just, just want to make sure you just said, yeah, he said, of course, when I thanked him for joining us. And he said, it's mm. really cool and didn't know the game was so streamed. That's one reason why we're here. This yeah. game does have a couple people streaming it, but um, not the way we want to. So we're gearing yeah. up, as we said, and uh, perhaps streamlined. Oh, streamlined. In other words, it's going quicker. Never mind. Yes, it is. I mean, we're doing explanations, so it is, yeah. it is going a little longer than, sure. but if. And it's, it's our yeah. first time. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah, our yeah. first time. Yeah. Before we had a hobby show, this is the yeah. first time we're actually playing the game on stream. Oh, it took me forever the first time. Mm -hmm. So, um, let's see here. Still does. Uh, we're going to go to... So, the Ghost Keel has a four-up ballistic skill. Um, mm -hmm. And uh, his war gear, or her, because the Tau don't care, is a mm -hmm. cyclonic... Is it the cyclonic ion blast? They're all androgynous. No, it's the cyclic ion raker. Yeah, you guys, uh, you guys have a bunch going guys have, my head. You guys have a bunch of uh, stuff going on here, um, and it's a heavy six, strength seven minus yeah. one d one. Yeah, yeah. All right, so I'm gonna shoot this. Yeah. At cool. That guy. Oh. All right. And see what's uh, just, nice. Just is, a bit of good game. I sorry to interrupt you. Yeah. But just a bit of good gamesmanship. This guy is my my big HQ leader guy. Yeah, yeah. So I mean, like like this guy's got a hellaciously more powerful gun. Uh -huh. But I just want you to be aware of it because I know they look almost exactly the same. Oh, absolutely, so I absolutely. I just you know I'm just gonna take this like I just want to shoot at stuff. Go for it. And we'll see what happens. For sure. You know, and then you'll shoot at my stuff. And we'll see what happens. You Definitely. Know? Um, yeah. You know, I know I know if you're probably watching this like uh. Wait, wait, well, if I yeah. had heard that Warhammer 40K was, like, really arcane... That's the word for it. ...with all the math it and was measuring just made, it's super slow compared to video game alternatives. Yeah. Yeah, so, like... That's true. Video games... Don't get me wrong. I mean, like, I love video games, obviously. Oh, yeah, obviously, yeah. Um, but, like, you know, video games are just, like, you know, instantaneous or instant gratification yeah, a lot of automated. times. Yeah, this, this is... You gotta do the work. This is I what happened it. when, like... I think you were explaining it when, mm -hmm. like... French royalty and nobles would yeah. play. This, this, yeah. th what we're doing right now, playing a tabletop game, especially playing a tabletop war game, is a Victorian thing to do. Yeah. Um, you know, um, uh, yeah, no, uh, war games like this, there are surviving accounts and, and portraits of H.G. Wells, you know, the author who wrote War of the Worlds. Oh, yeah, yeah. This is what he would love to do with his kids and his grandkids, oh. which is sit there with, with, um, with little miniaturized suits of armor. Rolling miniature cannonballs and playing war games. My brother's middle name is Victoria. Really? No. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So we're going <laughs> to. Should be, though. Um, all right. So I'm going to roll these guys, these bad boys. Mm -hmm. And we're going to see what happens. They got to be four ups. Hey, we got one, two, three, four. Cool. That's better than average. Yeah. That's pretty cool. These two missed by a mile. Yeah. Um, all right. So now I have, let's see, I have. Uh, Heavy six, strength seven. So you're an eight. I'm an eight. Okay, so that's you're literally too kind. But yes, right. I'm an eight. Five, five, <laughs> uh, nine in my book. Uh, five ups. Right, we gotta too do five kind. ups. Yeah. Oh. Hey, we got one. We got one. Hey, we Jerk. got one. We got one. Okay, okay. so okay. now I've so actually hit something. Yeah, yeah. So now that um, is it something? Desert to hit. 
Yeah, those were the... No, okay. no, those are the wounds. That's those what I thought. Yeah, yeah, okay. So you've actually wounded something. So yeah. the shot's gone. He's actually managed to hit what is right in front of him. Um, and actually... <laughs> All right. Uh, and now uh, he needs... Um, and he rolled to wound, and he made it. So what's the damage on that? It's on uh, the damage is uh, one. Okay, And cool. the AP is uh, negative one. Negative one? Negative okay, one. cool. Yeah. So now if I roll a four up, my armor has saved me. And, and he I rolls did. a five, so it totally saved him. Totally. Okay. Okay. So now I have one last move to make. Mm-hmm. Or shot to make, and that's mm-hmm. these two fusion blasters. Oh God! I know, right? They're just, they're just they're there. Just always there. See, they're scary, but like you know, every time you roll the dice, you always have a chance to miss. Yeah, that's really how it Feel works. Feel free to do that, by the way. I'm, I've been doing it like a champ. I know, right? Okay. It's been great. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, so here we go again. Four ups. Ah, uh, oh. two and a one. <laughs> so that'll do it. That'll, that's, that's really all I got. Super cool. Um, now I've completed the movement phase, mm-hmm. the psychic phase, the shooting phase. What's next? Uh, normally, it would be the fighting phase um, where, where you fight in close combat. In this game, that's the thing they streamline the most, and I'm most excited about it. Um, but we're not in range for any of that. Uh-huh. Um, so we're, we're simply going to skip it. And then um, the fifth phase um, um, is the morale phase. They made morale, morale. tests its own phase now. Okay. Um, but um, no one did any damage. No. Um, the way, no. <laughs> uh, that's what determines it is that okay. if you take if you take any casualties, mm-hmm. um, you roll a die and then compare that to your morale, and then you lose the difference. Interesting. So rather than because th- this game used to have people breaking and running away, mm-hmm. and then if you couldn't save yourself by the time you got to the edge, you were destroyed, and then that was that was breaking the game because there were some armies that just never had to worry about that, and some armies where if they lost some dude stubbed his toe, they spent the entire game being useless running off the board. Yeah. Now it's just you take more losses, okay. which is cool. So no okay. one runs away. You just take more losses. Nice. But nice. that didn't happen. Um, yeah. <laughs> Basically, no it's like it. if they just they lost it to the madness of war and they off themselves. Yeah, I like that. Okay, yeah. cool. Yeah, cool, yeah. cool. Cool, <laughs> cool, cool. Cool, cool. Cool. All right, so, so now, I'm done then. You are done, and, and it's now my movement phase. Okay, it's your movement phase. Cool. All right, so you're going to be moving in a phase. I'm going to be moving in your phase. Okay, cool. Cool. Um, right. I'm going to take a sippy poo of my, my coffee. Sippy poo. Yeah. Not a sip of poo coffee, though. No, so no, 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 yeah. no, 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 no. This is not Austin Powers. Remember? <laughs> it was a bit nutty, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, my God. Um, I, you know, okay. I remember these things. Yeah. Oh, that's wonderful. Um, I might be in horrifying amounts of pain right now, but I, I remember these things. Oh, <laughs> wow. Okay? He's getting right in. He's getting right. Yeah, it's just my, my back. That's oh. all right. That's all right. Cool. We can grab, um, grab you a chair or anything that you might need. Oh, no, I'm good. I'm just okay. being an old man. So now, how far does your tank move? It moves. They move six inches. Six inches. And okay. these guys move five inches. Five inches. All right. Cool. I'm just gonna march these guys straight up. Of course. That's what in guard do. They march into gunfire. Yeah. Yes, they do. Bravely. Die, die standing. Then. Yeah. Die standing. Yep. One of the funniest mods I ever saw was a um, uh, guards on Segway because they're still dying standing up. True. They're still riding in a battle. Very true. Guns blazing. One very, hand on very, some handlebars. Very true. But yeah. Very true. They still true. make Segways. Yeah, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, they still have segways. Those are the the um we have the ones that aren't that don't have the handle. Mm-hmm. Cuz segways are the things that you know you you do that and then you move forward, and you move back. Yeah. Um but um we have we have the ones where you just lean forward and back. I don't remember what the what those are called. Hoverboards? I think maybe hoverboards. Mm-hmm. I think that's the deal there. Hoverboard. Yeah. Who knows? Um Probably Google. For that matter. Probably. Um, but you know, I have a Google Bruh. phone, but I'm I like having the Warhammer rules here. Yeah. 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 Nah. No, I was saying Google probably does know, but I don't care to ask her. So I, I have a question. I probably have an answer. Can you break through terrain? You can go over it. Oh, okay. That um, but um, when you do that, that's when you possibly deal like dangerous terrain. Um, you could hurt yourself running across terrain, and I'm just not gonna risk it. Okay, I'm but, doing well because like he's got this. He, they I don't know if you guys can see. Oh yeah, they have this like that plow used to here. be a thing. Yeah, is it not a thing anymore? It's not. I'm gonna put my finger down so we know where it came from. It's right. not a thing anymore. No, it used to be. Um, whenever you bought an upgrade for anything, um, for for any of these units, um, you would have to model it on the model itself. Um, and um, now it's just a cool fluff piece. Like it used to be totally be. Um, is it for tank shock? Totally or something? be a thing. No, um, they actually um, just for laying down took road. that out. Just for laying down road. You know, just like flattening out. Vehicles road. now can fight in close combat like anything else. That's right. So things like tank track, yeah. tank shock, it wasn't a thing. Ah. Aren't a thing anymore. Okay. It was so cool, though. Interesting. I thunder blitzed you. I you thunder, thunder blitzed you. Yeah, good. that's right. You thunder that's blitzed right. me. 
Yeah. So I got good. thunder blisters all over my butt. He has thunder blisters all over himself <laughs> where the s- emperor's light don't shine. Right? Yeah. Um, cool, man. Um, so I... Actually, I'm going to move everything back. I'm taking move back and just by about an inch. Oh, I see. I see. I yeah. see. Oh, yeah, yeah. Cool. I'm not advancing. Otherwise, that would be... That would be crap. And yeah. then also, these guys, now... I think they might just be hiding in the back. Yeah, right? they're kind of going to do what these guys are doing. Actually, you don't, no, I'm not going to do that. I mean, they could be radioing, radioing back and forth to each other, like, we're yeah. not doing this. We're not either. It's like, oh my god, No, I'm I not going to do you. this, man. No, 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 I'm not either. It's like, it's <laughs> no, 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 the commanders are going to go at it. Yeah, 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 when they're dead, we're out of here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> those guys are... Those, those commanders, man, they're crazy. Yeah, they are. Wow. So, so I'm, I'm kind of I'm kinda out here with my pants down. Yeah, uh, I I've love got it. A, I've got a tank. Interpret that as you will. Yeah, I got a tank um, facing my commander, who I believe with is his pants off. With my pants off, I have a, uh, I have two crisis suits, no pants, um, and I have a ghost kill, zero pants. So this that's interesting. This mm-hmm. could be this could be really painful for me. Yep. Um, might be a shorter than usual game. So if it is for some reason, I get wasted in like two turns, then maybe we'll set up again. Yep. Um, and maybe, uh, maybe I'll add something else to my army. Yeah, yeah. Um, definitely. but you know, like I said, you know, it's a roll of the dice. Literally. You know? So, you never know. You mm-hmm. never know, man. You could, you could, you could shoot yourself in the foot. Indeedy doodle. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, All right, anyway, go ahead. I'm sorry. And God. then still be... Just I'm being, get... I'm being like that nervous, like, no, opponent please. that's like, oh. No, no, I'm enjoying it. I'm savoring okay. it. Okay. I'm drinking it in. <laughs> um, um, cool. So, I am going to be firing at you. Actually, you know what? For our super chill game... I think I will take another inch back. And again, course, I'm not advancing. I'm yeah, just yeah, yeah. taking yeah. a move back. Um, and so I don't think so. Thus completes my movement phase. I don't think I can see you with... Um, I'm going to try not to get my, my guys in my hair. I don't think I can see you with my belly guns there. Oh, no, I totally can. Oh, I totally can. Okay, Oh, cool. with, uh, no, what are the belly guns? Where are those? Laser cannons. They're, oh, the last right cannons here. are. Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, yeah I didn't guns. pay the points for the guns on the side, so we're not going to worry about those, the sponsons, um, because I don't need them to beat you. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Wow. Yeah. All right, well, Warmaster. Yes, indeed, you doodle. All righty, what are we cool. doing here? So first things first, I'm going to fire at your commander with my Demolisher Cannon. Get out of here, so really? So that does, really, really? Wow. That does um, uh, D3 hit, so it's heavy D3. So I roll a D6, that was a 1, and you have the result. So this game uses a D3 and a D6 system, but, you, you know, physically you need only buy D6s, and you just do the math yourself. Um, so I rolled a 1, so that kind of sucks. Um, that one's unlucky. I'm going to grab a different die. Um, I'm rolling your dice. That's a problem. That's a mm. problem. And uh, now, what's his what's his ballistics ballistic ballistic skill? skill his is ballistic um, skill? we're getting nice. I like that doing battle like Bugs Bunny and yeah, yeah. D- Duffy D- Duffy Duck Duffy, Duffy Duck. Duck. God, yeah. I'm tired. Okay, Duffy, um, so it's Duffy four Flick. up. Duffy uh, oh, he hit. hits me. He hits Super me. Oh, cool. and then now, what's the damage on this thing? This has uh, got to well, be pretty strength, big, right? The strength is ten, and the damage is Ooh, um, the strength is ten. I yeah, and then the damage is uh, D six. All right, let me see what's going to happen here because this is probably going to turn him into a paste. Cool. All right, uh, commanders. Don't toughness, be so graphic. I'm turning him into soup. Right is uh, five. Super cool. And he has six wounds. Okay, so oh, I am going to just need a two up in order to wound him. Got and it. he gets a two. Yeah. Okay. Now, um, this is going to do D6 damage, so oh I'm going to roll for that, and then you're going to get your save. Um, so six? He's six. dead. No, no, no. You oh, get to roll right, your that's save. that's right. That's right. Yeah. So armor piercing used to deny saves. It used to be if you, you would do the math using their <sighs> arcane system yourself, and then it'd be like, okay, you don't get a save. Now, your, my, save, my armor piercing modifies your save. Okay. So what's your armor so piercing? So it's minus three. Minus so whatever, three. So, so what's your save? I have a shield generator. Oh, that's bad. Let me bad see for what me. happens if I do cuz I I can't use both, right? Uh-huh. Or, or can I? Mm, um no. Okay. Wait, uh yeah, if you need to use the better save. So right, if you okay. have he's asking questions about your armor save versus your invulnerable save. Um your invulnerable save does not get modified. Um it's that you use your invulnerable save if it's the better one. So the save is what the save doesn't make you invulnerable. The save itself is what's invulnerable. Okay. And cover saves are now actually just a modifier to your armor save. There is no oh, more. Really? Yeah. There's now there used to be a different save depending on the cover you were behind, depending on your armor, depending on this thing called invulnerable saves, and they streamlined it. It's now it's now a modifier to your save. All right. So what's your save minus three, sir? Uh, it would be six if I did a regular. <laughs> Oh, However, you have the I have the shield generator, generator which is a four up save. <sighs> All right. So fine. it's that's still 50-50. I got so excited. So 50-50. It's a two, so he's dead. Cool. One shot kill. 
Beautiful. I didn't Commander even move on to my laser cannon. Blast it away. Sweet. There we go. So I just got three points. You get one point for killing a complete unit. You get one point for first blood and one point for slay the warlord, right. which is you kill your enemy's leader. So I just scored three points in one roll of the die. Wow. That's how good and not at all lucky. That's how good I am. Okay. Yeah, not at Alrighty. all. You see, it's, it's all in the wrist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, I'm not working um, my wrist out enough, apparently. <laughs> not at all. <laughs> so that's all one unit, you said, right? Yeah, this is all one unit. Okay, cool. Yeah. Uh, I think that before that, though, I'm going to, um, oh, I'm going to have bad knees when I'm old. Yeah, I'm going to shoot at that guy with, um, with this guy's two weapons. So okay. I'm going to start Now, I have a question. You. Do you have to shoot all of your weapons at him? They changed that. You no longer have to do that. You've been coming at me. You've been playing very intelligently and coming at me with a few really powerful mm -hmm. um, things. Well, um, so it hasn't been, absolutely. And uh, so it hasn't been an issue, but this game changed. Um, it used to be everything in a unit had to fire at the same target, mm. which kind of made sense. It, they were modeling, you know, everybody in a unit um, doing everything simultaneously. Really, whenever you're playing a turn-based game, it's modeling a billion different things happening all at once. Um, but they changed that. They just, you know, they realized how unnatural that felt and how unsatisfying it was. So mm. now everybody in a, in a unit can fire um, at anything... Um, Pretty much however they want. Oh, it yeah. was too powerful to say anybody can shoot at anything. You have to either fire everything at one um, um, for, the, for single units like this. Um, for, for one model, excuse me. Okay. Um, it's either every weapon at a different target or all your weapons at the same target. Okay. For groups of, of infantry where you have a, a unit made of a bunch of different models, okay. they can fire however they want to. You oh. can have all the anti-infantry weapons going to one target and then like the missile launcher going uh, that target. So like yeah. your teams actually work like a exactly. team. What a thought, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay, Weird, that's cool. isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I always thought that was weird from when they were like, you had to shoot everything at one thing. Yeah. And then it was like, but I got dudes with rocket launchers and I got exactly. dudes with plasma rifles, but I also got dudes with like Mm -hmm. regular rifles, but obviously yeah. you don't want to fire your regular it was rifles. Kind of, exactly. It was yeah. kind of funny when you realized, well, one of those guys is going to turn into mist because of the missile launcher. That's true. Like, that's, that was fun. Yeah. That was fun. But at the same time, it was just like, all right, boys with, you know, laser blasters that are just angry flashlights, yeah. shoot at the tank. You mathematically can't hurt. Wow. So that was dumb. Yeah, and yeah. they got rid of it. They, they, this game got a new CEO, and they're doing real customer service and real testing, and they're listening to their constituents which i think is great nice now did they did they take the other ceo and put him in the london tower or something or the tower of london um, or that's that is? what i put in my intensely worded letter um so i hope so okay cool. um i don't cool. remember a lot from those days All what right. can i say right. um nor should i nor, right. nor, do, nor do i want to should i say All so right. yeah moving on All right. um um so yeah um this guy is going to fire uh, these guys are not a unit, oh, by the way. I'm just hiding them. I'm oh, just yeah, hiding yeah, one yeah, guy yeah, behind yeah. the other. Okay. So they're not a unit. So, so this guy in the back... Could, now, could they be? Um, no. Oh, okay. They have to deploy that way, and oh, then nice. after that, um, they are their own dealios. Nice. So, uh, to use a technical term, dealios. Yeah. Dealios. Um, yeah. So, um, so my, my HQ is going to fire at your ghost kill. Okay. Um, and again, he's just called battle or tank commander. You know, there's Dope. actually something here that... Um, uh, hold on here. Holding. Okay, so... He's an infiltrator. We got that. Okay, so Electro Warfare Suite must subtract Sweet. one from hit rolls for models attacking Ghost Keel Shaz Vray. Mm -hmm. That's Jim right there. Mm -hmm. um, Jim Shaz Vray. From okay. more than 12 inches away. I don't know. Oh. Do you think that's more than 12? Well, there's one way to find out. And actually, I'm now that I've told you like that, you not... can rearrange your, your decisions no, on who fine. shoots at who. No, that's, that's totally fine. Um no, it's just out. Yeah. Oh, this really? Guy, this guy's in. Yeah. This guy's out. Because you measure from... Oh, crap. If he's got a base, you measure to his base. Oh. Um, and that's just shy. Actually, you know what? No, that is... I'll I give it to corner, you. His corner looks like it's there, though. I don't know. See, this is the great thing about the game, because you got to look at it and go... Yeah. No, I, I don't know, right. man. That's, no. that's up to you. You're the, the corner of, uh No, I think the corner of it's definitely touching it. Okay. Yeah. No, from where I first had it... Um, I was measuring it like there, and then I realized it's the closest point of the base. So before it wasn't, but now that I've corrected myself, it definitely is. So I'm going to be rolling four ups instead of three ups. He has well, actually, yeah. actually, I learned something else. So you're still yes. rolling three ups, okay? Right, but then we're just going to subtract it, right? And the reason why, and I and I was watching this like mm -hmm. stream. Uh, who are those guys? Miniwargaming.com or Miniwargaming? Those guys? Yeah. I think it was. Who's the guy with the glasses, Matt? No. Um, He's got the glasses. Is it Matt? No. It is Matt. Anyway, yeah, he was no, saying the reason why you do it in that order is because, like, you'll have a down the road, like, weird, I don't know specifically mm -hmm. what, but weird things where it's like, oh, but you could re-roll, but then you could do this. Yeah. Like, you have to, like, that way it's subtracting instead of actually 
Gotcha. Anyway, that's just no, my no. Thing. That's really important. Right. No, no, no. They they make it seem really needlessly complicated. The people who wrote these rules, but there are a lot of real substantial reasons behind it. Like, well, there are these other things that modify it, and you get these rerolls. Right, so right. that's really important. So I'm going to roll. Then I'm going to see. Um, then I'm going to see um, how I do. Mm-hmm. So um, it's heavy D6. So first I do that. Okay, so four. Four. Okay. So yeah. Um, and three up to hit. And oh my God, look at all wow, those ones one, and twos. One, two, one. Never it's mind. It's a good thing it doesn't overheat, right? <sighs> yeah. There's all right, so what's next? Uh, the belly gun, the, the laser cannon. Now what, is, now, what is this guy? That's a laser cannon. That's, that's a big old laser, um, just big old laser blaster. Okay. It's is it another one. D6, D3 no, thing? No, nothing like that. Oh, it's, it's heavy one. one. Okay. Yeah, it's one shot. Okay. Um, it's really powerful, though. It's now, um, um, it's still strength nine, but it's, oh. it's uh, damage three. Oh, okay. Interesting. Cool. Interesting. So, yeah, so it's now still three up to hit. All right. And I hit. Ooh, you hit. You yeah. hit. Now, so what's, what's the your, strength? W- uh, strength nine. What's your strength toughness? Strength nine, toughness six. So you'll be doing what? Three up? Yeah. Yes, indeed. Right? If I'm, if That's exactly right. Because it would have to be right. double the strength, half the. Yeah, t- exactly. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Three up. Okay, so, so three, three up. up. Oh, and I it's a one. one. All right. God. That's a one. All okay. right. That happens. <clears throat> uh, that's one thing I forgot to mention is that um, it used to be all, all values in this game were limited to um, 10. And that's no longer right. the case. So when you said it's strength 18 and I went, Really? It's because that's now oh, a that's thing. that's right. That is a it's thing. It's now a thing. I totally forgot yeah. about so that. So, like, for, yeah. for that system, like, you could have a toughness yeah. 18 thing, and I could have a, a strength 9 weapon. Nice. Yeah. So this nice. whole, let's not even, like, a lot of people played this game and said, what's the point? That was actually, like, a measurable, that wasn't pessimism. That was just, like, no, really, that's mathematically impossible thanks mm. to this arcane system. Yeah. None of that anymore. Nice. Cool. Very so now, um, that was so much fun, I'm going to do it again. But I'm going to shoot at these guys. Um, okay. Because okay. I can okay. reach them easier. So, right. uh, D6 to see how many shots that cannon makes. Six. Six. Wowzers. Dope. Do they have any more... Wowzers. Um, do um, they have any funny business uh, support systems like the Ghost Kill? No, no, no. They have no funny business in that direction, okay. sir. In that direct, Not in that direction. Yeah. Um, okay. So, okay. four better to hit because they're ra- uh, average tank. Ooh, three. No, no, no. Got uh, three there. Yeah. You got three, three hits. Three. All right. Yeah, All right. yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, oh, cool. let me find out what their toughness is because I'm not really even paying attention. No worries. Yeah. How are you feeling, by the way? I'm I'm doing a little better. Like I'm still Good. a little like lightheaded. Okay. Well, don't so, hurt like, yourself. I don't want to like. If you need to sit out, sit out. You're just you're just like trying to get me to mercy. You're like, no, no, yeah. man, yeah. just mercy it. No. Concede. No, man. Okay, so toughness five, wounds three. Toughness five, wounds three. So mm-hmm. I'm going to be wounding on three up. Holy All smokes! Okay. okay, cool. Um, and damage. What's the damage yeah. on these bad boys? Damage is going to be, I believe, it is D fifty. D fifty. That's wow. exactly right. No, it's it's. Um, um, oh, I thought it was damage three. It's D six. That's right. I don't know what I was thinking of. Okay. So cool. D six. Yeah. So. Um, so you have to roll eighteen dice. <laughs> no. No. Um, so. Um, yeah, you roll one for for everything. Okay. Um, and it's so six. six. So what does that do? 18 wounds. Yeah. Okay. And then what's your... What's your um, negative your, 3. Negative 3. And these Oops, guys... wait a minute. Was I looking at the wrong thing? I was looking at the wrong thing. I think it's the same. No, they're D3. Oh, they're Okay, D3. so I'm just going to re-roll that. Okay, that's, yeah, not sure. fair, yeah. that's fine. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay with that. Yeah, cool. I'll bet. Oh, and it's only one of these. I, I, that was my bad. Um, five. Five. So that's okay, so that three. comes out to three. Yeah, so I did three wounds to you, unless you save against it. Okay. And it's um, AP minus 2. Minus 2. So I have a... Save of three up, and they don't have any shield shenanigans, so it becomes a five up. And how many do I roll? Just one, right? You roll, um... Or three. You roll three. Three. All right. Yeah. Three. Correct the moon dough. Five ups. So I save one, one, but two of them I don't. Correct. And then I put two wounds on one of these guys. No. Okay. So it's two times three, because that's what I rolled. Oh, so okay. So six. So it's six. Yeah. So okay. six wounds go through. So that's both of them? That's both of them. That's both of them. That's both of them. Because they're two separate shots, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah, so that's both of them. Wow, you just, just like you just obliterated that. Okay, mm-hmm. cool. Cool, cool. I mean, not, but whatever. Yeah. Jerk. Okay. Yeah. Cool. All right. I so, get that a lot when I'm winning. <laughs> I do, too, actually. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> cool. All right. Um, so, man, you don't really have much to shoot. I mean. Oh, I could shoot those yeah, guys. Yeah, you can shoot those guys, those guys at that guy. Those but those and then yeah, we're, we're getting thing. we're getting whittled down real fast here. Whittling. Yeah. Oh, whittling. 
Um, so those are a bunch of angry f- the angry flashlights I mentioned. Right, right, right. Um, right, right. Plus um, three grenade launchers. Okay. Yeah, so they have uh, two firing modes. One's the anti-infantry one. <laughs> I'm not going to be using that. Um, and the other one is the uh, uh, the um, just the stronger one. It's uh-huh. not really like anti-vehicle. But uh-huh. again, anything can wound anything in this game now. Um, so yeah, so we have... Um, so let's measure the range um, uh-huh. because these guys are... This guy's in the back of the special weapons. Um, is that a 12? Oh, yeah. No, I can hit you. Oh, yeah. Hit yeah, you where yeah. the good lord split you. Wow. Cool. So um, there would be... Um, what is... 6 times 2 is 12. 12. Yeah. It's, um, it's all right. It's getting late. <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, Okay. Cool. Then one for the pistol guy. Eh, everybody brings a pistol guy. There's always that guy. Um, okay. So I'm going to roll these first. Um, normally we'd be rolling these things simultaneously, but we only have one color die. And we're playing a small game, so it's not that much slower. Um, but normally you can roll different types of weapons at the same time. We just say, okay, the red dice are going to be the grenade launchers. Oh, the right, but we, all we have is launcher. the same color yeah. dice. So that's yeah, fine. Yeah, 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 no, yeah, we're, yeah. we're not playing a big enough all game right, for it to slow us down. So uh, to hit is going to be four up. All right. Yeah. So that one's <laughs> Another dice. No, you shot me in the balls. <laughs> you've been just tearing Excellent. me in half. This is great. Mm-hmm. Well, and look at the way that you've you framed yourself there. Well, I mean, I mean like, to be honest. Uh, there aren't any balls there, so I, I did hit you. To be yeah. honest, you're not going to make the War Master look good. Go ahead. Go for it. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> That's my excuse for today. What? <laughs> to make the War Master look oh, good. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, so these are all oh, of... Yo, strength on yeah, those. I got to check. Three. Yeah, strength yeah, is I three. Check. I'm sorry. I'm not nothing. paying attention. Okay, okay. It's, it's, it's nothing. It is nothing. It's nothing. Honey. Yeah. All right. Uh, so what's your toughness? Toughness is six. Don't say six. Crap. Okay. So it's so, going to be... Um, so it's going to be six up. Six up. Wow. You're going to get a few, though. Yeah, you got, I got two. two. See, cool. that, that happens. So you t- absolutely get your full save. Okay, okay. Uh, my full save is an amazing three up. That is good. It's the same three as my up. tanks. Three up. Here we sure. go. Hey, I made both of them. Hey. All made right. Both. So Ghost Keel survives this round of shooting yeah, yeah, yeah. from these guys, but now I have grenade launchers to deal with. Yes, indeed you do. Now, how do these work? Now, you said uh, the same way. Okay. Um, they're, they're assault weapons. Uh-huh. How that changes is pretty cool. It means that because um, now you, you can shoot in tr- anything you want in charge. So there's no limit on that. Interesting. It's so good. Oh. Yeah, it's so good. Um, what assault weapons now let you do? This is not not the situation we're in. It's just really cool for you, you veteran players out there. Yeah, yeah. Um, me, is that, that um, yeah? Let's All pop right. squat, son. All right. We're gonna talk to you about assault weapons. Mm. Um, um. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I need to get know, some toilet paper. Anyway, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's funny. Normally, when, when we do their big streams, we have these headsets so we can listen to each other, how we actually sound on stream. Yeah, yeah. For a small stream like this, we don't bother. But, like, we look like NFL coaches, but we're just a bunch of nerds making stuff. So, I mean, like, we need, like, like polo shirts and, like, dark khaki trousers, and we need to, like, cover our faces like, like the ESPN cameras are watching us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, it'd be funny, just, like, intense stares and, like, you can't see my mouth. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to let you see my yeah, mouth yeah. when I'm calling shots. Yeah, you're going to run to the right. You're going to run to the right. Yeah. Absolutely. You know? And then a bunch of millionaires who come up with drivel as sports commentators. Yeah, and then Brady and throws a game-winning pass. Yeah. Anyway, go it's ahead. Annoying. It's predictable. It's what it yeah. is. Yeah. Um, you get to run away um, and shoot. Like, you get to fall uh... back, but you get to also make a shot. Okay. It's really cool. Okay. All right. It's really cool. So this is just, for what I'm doing, it's just a normal shot. All right. We're just geeking out. I apologize for nothing. So four better to hit. Um, cool. Two. That's better False. than I thought. All right. Here, toughness six, right? Toughness six. Strength? Uh, six. Six. So it's a four up. Four up. Both hit. Dope. All right. Um, it's AP. Uh, they're both. Actually, you know what? There's got to be some they're DM both, behind that. There's got to be some DM. Yeah, yeah. Um, there's got to be some DM. Um, yeah. Like Robbie, there's always some D power behind it. He is. He's the D power. Yeah. It was very, fu- uh, you know, I'm not going to say that on stream. Uh, never mind. Yeah. Um, yeah. We're, uh, we're, uh, we're not a kid's show, but we also don't want to offend every person on the planet day one. Yet. Yeah. Yet. So. Yet. Um, yeah. There's that. Yes, indeed. Um, it should be uh, D1, but I'm checking that right now. All right. Um, oh, it's D3. 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 So I roll one die to determine that. Um, of three. It's three. Of course yeah. it's three. So you get to make your save, though, and it's just uh, minus one. So I'll do um, six wounds if... I don't make if a you four don't up save. Roll two four Which up would saves. totally... Kill you? No. But it would, it would oh, do man. a lot of damage. So three ups. 
Hey, I made both uh, of them. No, no, no. They need to be um, forced because I'm negative one. Right. So I missed both of them. Yeah. So he's down to four wounds now. Excellent. Wait, so how many wounds did he start with? Ten. Oh, I was like, oh, man, I think he did math wrong, but yeah. now it's still there. No, no, no. But I'm Ugh. now, I'm now <laughs> at the halfway point. So, and here, now here, see, now this is interesting. I didn't do any damage to your vehicles. Mm -hmm. We can talk about this at least. See, mm -hmm. this is good. Like, at least we're going through the steps here because you totally. obliterated the other guys. Yeah. But I don't think crisis suits change their stats when they get damaged. Correct. So you remember what I was So this is yeah, going to be cool. Okay, so it says this here. This replaced what vehicles go through, mm. went through, because before they would have a bunch of different armor facing, and then it would, the value of things. So you can concern. go through that if, with yeah. them. Yeah. So cool. um, um, they, would, um, um, they would not degrade over time, but they would just take damage very mm. differently. Mm -hmm. And this is a mm -hmm. really convoluted system. Now, though, um, things degrade. Both vehicles and big, what are called, what used to be called monstrous creatures, um, they degrade. As you as you deal damage to them, mm -hmm. as they take damage, because they have boo boos, they, they get, get boo boos, they, they get boo boos, and they can't, and they get a lot of boo boos. Yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. it just makes them angry. Yeah. They, so, they get worse though. Yeah. So now, if you had done uh, four, which you did not, but if you right. had done four, I would have stayed at movement twelve inches, ballistic four plus, and attacks three. Mm -hmm. But since you did six, I'm now down to four wounds, yeah. and between three to five wounds, I now have a movement of eight. A ballistic skill of five plus, <laughs> and only two attacks now, which cool. doesn't matter because I'm never going to get in close combat with something like that. Yep. All right. You got everybody got better in this game, so like you're not as bad off in close combat as you once were. True. Mm -hmm. True. I should have brought like a bunch more units. So this is good. Yeah. This is really good. Yeah. You were worried, but when we when we started, you were worried. You're like I was worried. I was. Yeah, yeah. I was just like, oh man, maybe I should have taken that other tank. That would have just ended this game already. I have an artillery tank where all that you know. Oh, well, hold on. You can't see them. It's got a range the size of the, not the size of the table, the size of the room, and I don't have to see anything mm -hmm. to hit it. Mm -hmm. So I could just could have just mm -hmm. been sitting mm -hmm. back mm -hmm. with a Mai Tai and mm -hmm. beating you, living mm -hmm. up to the show that I named myself mm -hmm. Paradise to sit back with a Mai Tai. Mm -hmm. All right, so yeah. now he's down. So what else do we have? Is that... That is... That's it, right? Yeah, I can't hit anything, reach anything with these guys. All right. Good enough. So it's your turn. Oh, boy. Oh, boys. Alrighty, um, cool. This is gonna be a real. This is very one-sided. I, I think this is interesting. Mm -hmm. Playing open play like this, very good. Mm -hmm. I think it also gives people an idea of like how I don't know how like each each group or each unit really does have to like like has like a certain amount of power and mm -hmm. points, and that balance gets better as we move up the sophistication exactly. from like power level to like exactly. to points. Um, I'm making excuses. I hope all of you are enjoying this. Um, all right, am. so these I guys, move these guys. Gary, and I hope you're enjoying yourself. You oh. know, I hope everybody's enjoying themselves yeah. watching me get my Gary book Gary said a while ago, but we were, we were deep in, in the complexities of this game, mm. um, which, is that, um, which is funny that I say that, because he says, I mean, there's a lot of, he's comparing uh, 40K to D&D. &D. There's a lot of, and saying that this game was streamlined. Um, there's a lot of knowledge that you need to have so it's not like playing chess or checkers where you pick it up mm. and play but it's not as slow as D&D for the first time mm -hmm. yeah no it's nuts mm -hmm. playing this game for years I thought D&D would be quick to pick up and it's just not no 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 D&D is not quick to pick up in fact I need to be reminded of things all the time when I'm playing D&D &D. I tell you um, just so you guys know Gary and I think you're Gary Garyans there's a oh, there's Gary and now there's Garyans Garyans um, I have a dark elf druid oh I've, dope I've I didn't said know this you before D &D. yeah yeah um, I believe level eight or nine. Cool. Yeah, getting up there. Cool. Uh, name is Legolas Calrissian. <laughs> okay. You have not told me this story. Yeah, sir, that is awesome. Well, because you can make up any name you want. Of course. Right. So it's like Legolas Calrissian, yeah. or just Portmanteau. You know, Skywalker Fett, or you know, yeah. so, or, or you know, something like, yeah, yeah, yeah. like you can you can mix oh, and yeah. match. You know, like. Like a Trades, Darth um, Dothraki. Yeah, like you know, you can do all that stuff. I mean, it's that's and that's part of the fun. So yeah, mm -hmm. Legolas Calrissian, the most baller dark elf, and he's got to be a dark elf because he's a Calrissian. Um, but he's an elf, so he's got to be a Legolas, which is sweet, right? Right? Like, oh yeah. Okay, I'm just, oh, I'm yeah. just no, saying. That's excellent. I'm just saying. Yeah, it's a baller name. That all is. Right. No, that's so. That's I'm gonna move these guys damn up. Fantastic. Um, this is. This is roughly two inches, so they can move six, so that's three, and then that would be seven. So I'm just going to move all these guys up, like, right to the edge here. Living on the edge. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And you know what's interesting? 
This is something I, I in this game actually, you know what's you know what's fascinating? I should have moved these guys up. Mm. And the reason why is because like we were talking about like They'll damage and stuff. They'll be easier to hit. They'll be easier to hit, but you, you but the um tank weapons dun, dun, dun. aren't meant to kill a lot of dudes. They're meant to kill like Correct. one big dude. Yeah. So these yeah, are a lot of exactly. little dudes. Mm -hmm. And so not not having moved them actually was a big mistake. See, this is part of the new game because the old game, I don't know if you could have or not, but you could have like blast templated them and then they would have all been blue goo. Yes. You know? So, you know, we're, we're going to chalk this up to me not knowing what I'm talking about mm -hmm. half the time. So, and slowly um, learning how to play again, which yeah. is going to be cool, right? Because, you know, we got to learn. Yeah, absolutely. No, that's one so. of the things I'm most, another thing I'm super excited about is that uh, we're learning it all again. You know, so, I get to teach this game and on camera. Right? This is awesome. Absolutely. So that's uh, going to be probably the same. So two inches, mm -hmm. uh, three inches. Okay, so I'm going to move these guys. Well, wait a minute. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, that'll work. Wait, wait. Yeah, yeah. No, wait. Wait. Yeah, that works. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I just had to double check, triple check, quadruple no, check. No, that's fine. To make sure that the tape Hold measure on. Did you check again? Yeah, it worked. Thank you for that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Um, oh, I think I have something crawling up my leg. Nope, it's just a weird tingle. Cool. Man, I've been getting these weird tingles up and down my legs. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I don't know. I should probably, like, go to a doctor someday. No. Nah. I should just drop no. dead and yeah, then be like... be fine. Yeah, you know. I, yeah, I, it's fine. I'm a Catholic. I'll be It'll fine. Be... <laughs> just on, say you're sorry. Did something... it do it again? Oh, what's going on? Now it's out, out. Oops. I no, 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 it's on. What? And it's back on again. Huh. I have no idea what this. Sorry, I don't folks, know. If, I have well, no you know, idea what yeah, that yeah. Is. You know, actually, just um, Ben, Benson. So you don't have to do anything, dude. I'm just talking to you because you could probably hear me from here. Hello. But uh, the Sony is is coming in and out of power, and I don't yeah. know if that's because of this power thing. Because remember, we were having problems with it well, earlier. So anyway, I'm just gonna throw that out at you. Um, I'm gonna blame bad dice luck. Bad dice luck. Camera problems. And um, having to fight Horus, I'm sorry, the War Master himself. Yeah. So that's how that's going to yeah. work. Yeah. Alrighty. So everybody, well, no, no, I can move this guy. I also forgot about him. Yeah, I can move that guy. Crap. Not that it's going to matter. It's always pretty dope him. dropping him down in the middle and just being like, you know what? You I'm going to go in a blaze of my own badassery. Oh, my back. Uh, okay. But I can move him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just gonna, I'm just going to look at the rule book like this. <laughs> And yes. hopefully I'll be able to stand upright again. He's, wow, I was already on. He's not oh. kidding. He's actually just I'm making more, himself I'm comfortable. Okay. You sure uh, you're okay? okay? I don't want so, you to. No, no, I'll be fine. I'll be thing. fine. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, wait, 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 wait. Did you say Warhammer quit? is not worth it? I, I definitely no, we didn't can't say quit. that. We can't quit. We can concede we can't and quit. let me win. I mean, I, I mean I'm going to concede. I mean, you've, really, you've already won. I'm just saying, like, yeah. we, I don't want to quit. I want to keep this going. Because, so, mm -hmm. like, if you shoot at these guys, we can have an example of big guns versus lots of guys. Exactly. And how yeah, that yeah, works, yeah. right? Because you're oh, going to have yeah. a bunch of damage, but then we have to go through what happens with individual sure. models in a, in a unit. Which is damage. totally different. Right. So I'm not worried. Like, this is good. Like, mm -hmm. it's actually better that it's lopsided, in fact. So sure. that way we can I go through I tell myself that stuff. every day. I mean, it does kind of lean to the left, but, you know, whatever. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um, so, yeah, but no, this is, good. Politics, this is good. by the way. Of course. Yeah. Um, yeah, of course. Like, no, I'm like, this is great. Like, we're doing good stuff here. Mm -hmm. Great work here. Absolutely. And we're only going to get better at it. Always. Also, he, you're a cheater. <laughs> um, <laughs> all right. So, so I can move that guy. I can move him four massive inches. At least that's what I tell myself mm -hmm. at night. <laughs> all right. So there's uh, two inches there. Hey, mobility problems are no joke if you can only move four inches at a time. two inches there, which isn't going to matter because I guarantee mm -hmm. you, see, now this is what's going to happen. He's going to move these guys here. He's going to move this guy here. They're going to point their guns. Mm -hmm. and they're going to shoot him, and he's going to explode. Well? Yeah, so I'm going to put him right here. <laughs> okay, so he's down there. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, my gosh, look. His trap door is open. Oh, my God. Yeah, he's, that model is awesome. Himself. There we go. Okay, that's better. That model is... One of my favorites. These are great. Heck, yeah. Actually, I think the Ghost Keel is probably my favorite model it's now. It's one of my favorite too. That thing's beautiful. Yeah. yeah as, as far as like like the Riptide's kind of neat. That's what I should have brought. That would have evened this out so much. The Riptide. Yeah. It's not as you. you it's just me. too many you points though. Better. 
Yeah, no, you would have done better, but it's not as cool as like infiltrating him. You know, that's true. like if you had had better luck, this would have been so much more interesting because yeah. you dropped the guy there, and he was there to support all the other guys who deep strike. Yeah, and he just yeah, nothing happened. Yeah. Also, maybe as like a strategic, I'm just going back and mm-hmm. you know, I'll let you guys know. Maybe instead of putting the two here and the one there, I should have stacked them on one side. Cool. That way you wouldn't have been able to get two shots plus one over here. Mm-hmm. Right? You would have had to force move into this area. And, yeah, see, this is what I like about this game because it's yeah, like yeah, you yeah. get to go through it anyway. Okay. Totally. All right, so I totally. moved those guys. I moved those guys. Moved those guys. And I'm going to murder those guys and then um, those guys and then those guys. Yeah, yeah. most likely. Mm-hmm. Give me a minute. <laughs> All right. Um, so I'm going to do... I'm going to do the quick one first. I'm going to shoot this guy at that, or shoot this guy, shoot at that guy with this guy. Although, in his state, I might as well put him in a cannon and shoot him at him. All right. Um, and it's going to have to be five up. Gotcha. And marker lights, I think they're still heavy weapons. That's good. I would look that up. Yeah, I have no idea up. if marker lights are still heavy weapons I or not. I can't remember if I can move or not. I don't think so. I don't remember. See, this is, this is what happens when, okay. Asthma. You read my mind. Ingleberry. I don't know why I'm thinking. Such Mark thing. Light. Why am I not seeing? There we are. Yeah, it's a heavy one. It's a heavy one, so I cannot shoot them. Mm. Wait, no, I move. So does that mean I can't shoot them, or do I get a negative to my ballistics? How does heavy weapons work now? Heavy weapons work now? Yeah. Yeah, heavy weapons mean that um, if you move, you get a negative one to your ballistic right, skill. Right, but that... I can still shoot. Absolutely. All right. I'm you gonna... can still move and shoot, and you can move and charge, too. Really? Yeah. Get no, this game just had so many restrictions to different things. And yeah, just, like, I'm used to being, yeah. like, just chained yeah, down. Yeah, just like, yeah, no, okay, I can't move or charge, and that's not true. Right, 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 right. Oh, if you fall back, you can't fire heavy weapons. But I, uh, I want to okay. double-check that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you're facing the wrong way in the first place. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Or you could just be really motivated with your giant machine and just, go, ah, ah, just shoot yeah, it and behind just you as you're running away. Yeah. You hit as on a seven away. up. Yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> Alrighty. So I'm gonna do that. Okay. So they're normally their ballistic skill is four plus. Yo. But now it's gonna be five plus. Yo. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna do that. Here we go. We're gonna. And and the rules for marker lights have completely changed. So yeah, I don't know anything about marker technically lights. Technically, this be is a funny Taub thing he's doing. It's this really cool benefit, this really cool buff. Buff. Um, but I have I don't know how it works because they changed it, and I'm not the blue blue alien. Hmm. So how do these work? I don't know. <laughs> Let me go look at this. I have no it. idea how marker lights work. If you were in the middle of like a roll to hit, I know that that's the same. You still have to hit with them like a normal weapon. So yeah. I didn't mean to interrupt that. No, no, no. You can interrupt all you want, man. I'm trying to figure cool. out what this stuff does. Army list. Hold on. Does this have mark lights? Mark lights. Okay. So when I get okay, so when I shoot a mark light at somebody, they get the token. Mm-hmm. They get the, the the token, and then for one token, um, I get to re-roll hits of one. Uh, for two tokens, I get to shoot a destroyer or seeker seeker missile. What? Um, at the ballistic skill. Of the, the unit instead of what? six. Instead of six. That's nuts. Yeah. Do you so, have to have it or does it just no, come out? No, okay. Yeah, I was gonna say, is this like one of those No 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 no? Okay. No, no. I was Because remember say they took all that stuff nuts. out, right? They took all the silly formations oh. out. Right, right, right. Well at right. least until we get codexes again, I guess. Yeah. But there's no, um everyone gets the same detachments now. Because oh. before it was well you you can take these incredibly cheap units and these really small numbers and get these crazy special rules. Right, right. Um and it was all different. It was you know, I, I don't know how they did it. Look, it seems so chaotic now. But now everybody still gets um, the same detachments, but in the same patterns. Like you okay. take an HQ and three elite, the three true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so they just evened it all out. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> all right. Uh, if I have three marker lights on one unit, model attacking the unit. Uh, the, wait, hold on. Models attacking this unit do not suffer the penalty for moving and firing heavy weapons and advancing and firing assault weapons. Um, at four, I get the target unit does not gain any bonus to its saving throw for being in cover. Mm-hmm. All right. And for five or more, I get add one to hit rolls for Tau Empire models attacking this unit. So it gives plus one to ballistic. Dope. But actually it says... 
Uh, yeah, two hit rolls, so it's not actually like web. Wait, 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 wait. No, I wouldn't be able to work. It said two hit, right? Isn't yeah, like no, no, no. That counts for both shooting and close combat. Oh, that's pretty yeah. nice. All right, cool. So instead of hitting on a, on a, on a five up, they hit on a four up in close combat. Mm -hmm. That's pathetic. All mm -hmm. right, so here we go. Five ups. Dang. Three. Dang. I just wasted all of my good, all <laughs> of my good rolls. C'est la guerre. On that. So now they're at, uh, I get to reroll hits of one, and I get to move. I can ignore firing heavy weapons and stuff like that, the penalty for doing that. And uh, I could shoot a, uh, a Seeker missile if I had one, but I don't. Does it say you have to have one? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, gotcha. Yeah, yeah. I was just like, I remember. Because it's a thing. Like, you actually yeah. equip it to a unit. Mm -hmm. There was that old, there was that old uh, formation where you could get a Seeker missile, like, out of nowhere. That's what I remember. But that one, it, that formation doesn't exist anymore. God, that'd yeah. be scary. It would be, but Seeker, actually, Seeker missiles aren't that bad. It's the destroyer ones that are nuts. That you have on Serge, who's in the other on room. On Serge, I do have. Yeah, I do have them on Serge. Um, so, mm -hmm. I'm going to shoot the Cyclonic Ion Raker, which I believe was a heavy six. But you know what I'm going to do? Because mm -hmm. you know what? Who cares at this moment? I'm going to overcharge the weapon. So now we can explore this. Yes. This is exciting. Now we get to explore what this does. Can I actually turn this on its side? No. Oh, that's obnoxious. Yeah. It's because it's a, it's a Google it's an e -book, book thing. And an ebook thing. So you can't, like, turn it to the side. You yeah. have to, like, zoom in. It's, like, kind of junk. <laughs> By the way, if you guys can fix that, Games Workshop or Google or whoever, mm -hmm. that would be great. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to overcharge this. It's going to be a heavy D6. So... It's a one. Okay. That's still scary. All right. <laughs> um, it's going to have... So I guess I roll this. So this is going to be a five up. And I re-roll ones. I can't re- Oh! Uh, damn! Never heard you make that noise. That oh. Yeah. Oh. Okay. So that completely missed. However, if that was a one, right? Because I overcharged it. So actually, let's just say it was a one. If you make one or more hit rolls of one, the bearer suffers a mortal wound after all this weapon shots have been resolved. What is uh, that? What's that about? Mortal wounds are scary. Mortal wounds are wounds that happen automatically and cannot be saved against anything. Okay. So you just if you hit them and it says causes mortal wound, take the number of damage. That's okay. it. Okay. All right. And uh, and but 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 but. After all the weapon shots have been resolved, so it still shoots. It still makes the shot, right? Because mm -hmm. it says, it says uh, 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 if it makes uh, one or more hit rolls of one. Oh, well, actually, you I would have made a hit roll of one, and that misses anyway. Am I down like this? Yeah. Oh. oh, was it pointing like this? All right, but there's a down. Not up. Down. Okay. All right. It's just because I'm so close to you, it kind of... Anyway, so, um, okay, so yeah, so that actually doesn't matter. But what does matter is that if I had rolled a one, he would have taken a wound. Yes. Okay, and there's no save. Correct. Okay. Now, trivia, Yo. is there a save that can ignore a wound or mortal wound? No. None no. whatsoever? None. Even feel no pain? Feel no pain is the kind of thing that you get to that you get to roll um, only if it's not a mortal wound. Feel really? no pain. Yeah, it's not called feel no pain anymore. It's now. Um, it seems more complicated on the surface, but it's yeah, a lot yeah, simpler. Yeah, which yeah. is just that um, every every unit gets its own special rules, and then a lot of them just do the same thing as the other ones. Uh -huh. And it used to be called feel no pain, where it was this. It's you know basically a second save, which is if you lose uh, your save and uh -huh. take a wound. Roll this other dice. Don't call it a save, though. Oh. And then you actually save against it. Um, now oh. it just says, unless it was a mortal. Oh. Mortal wounds are scary. Interesting. They are scary. They are scary. But, you know, when you get shot in the head, it's hard to survive that. I don't know. We're in the grim dark. The, the grim, grim derp the, future. The grim gurk. The grim gurk. The grim derp. The grim derp. We are in the grim derp. And when you're in the sure. grim derp, man, you just, you're in the derp. You're in you're All in right. So it. now we got two fusion blasters. Oh, I keep forgetting yeah. about this. So now we got to do five ups to hit, mm -hmm. re-roll ones. 
Yippee ki yay. Hey, it's a five Aww. and a six. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Dun, 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 dun. It yeah, doesn't yeah, matter, yeah. though. I still yeah, have to yeah, roll to yeah. wound. So the roll to wound is uh, eight, and you're an eight? No, you're I'm an eight. You're an eight. So this is going to be four ups. You told me I was a nine last time. Well, you are, but the tank is an eight. I'm sorry. I've seen prettier tanks. <laughs> oh, and I fell oh, off the edge there. It. So I'm going to roll this one real it's not quick. Even worth picking up. Oh, no, we didn't. We didn't. We got two and a three. Okay. Oh, that's a four down there. I shouldn't have re-rolled. That's all right. It mm -hmm. fell off the table. That's fine. Um, that okay. That carpet's so, so far from clean. I'm surprised that died and just start walking back towards us. It might have. Yeah. You know, it probably was already on its way. All right. So nothing happened there. Yeah. That's a shame. All right. So we're going to move on. Um, I'm going to take, oh, hold on. I have to make sure these guys are within 30 inches of this guy. Oh, I'm sorry. Was that too far? <laughs> um, so here's 30 inches. It okay. depends. Are you on first? Uh -huh. No, I think I'm getting the third, buddy. <laughs> All right. So there's uh, 30 inches there. 30 inches there. All right. So we're, we're in the money here. All right. We're in the money. We got 12 shots. Great. At four up. Strength five. AP zero mente. So All right, um, so three, six, nine, 453. That's 12. That's right, I can count by threes. Mm -hmm. um, Lucky. You know, I try. Uh, let's see here. I have to do four ups. Four ups, buddy. Here we go, four ups. By the ball, eh? That's pathetic. That's not One, bad. two, Deuce. three, four, five. Six shots hit. Those guys are a waste. Strength, hold on. Pulse something. The pulse blast cannon. I wish I had that on these. Pulse. Rifle. Strength five, AP nothing. You are toughness. Eight. Eight. So this has got to be six. No. Almost. It's got to be five ups. Five ups to wound. Hey, I got one. Oh, God. I got What's one. The damage on those things? This Damage is, is uh, one. Oh, God, thank God. All right. Roll it, buddy. Three up. Looks oh, like I, a almost I almost caused a wound. You almost I haven't even caused a wound. a wound on you yet. Nope. Yeah, this is amazing. Okay. No. Their, their carbon footprint is a more threat to them at this point. Yeah, at this point, whatever planet they're on is probably just yep. uninhabitable because mm -hmm. of the... They don't even use gasoline. They use coal. Yeah. Liquefied coal that's dipped in like crude oil mm -hmm. and like old dinosaur parts. Because yeah. why not? And they burn that in order to run these. Mm -hmm. So it's not really like the smoke's black. It's actually just, it pours out. Mm -hmm. It actually pours in the back like tar. It's, it's pours a liquid. Out. Yeah. It just yeah. bubbles and shoots out the back. Yeah. 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 And then chaos just turns out to be some, some, some jerk hippie who's lecturing everybody. That is chaos. Yeah, That's yeah. Chaos. They're like, it's you're evil. Just, yeah, you're. It's you're, awful. You're ruining this planet, and they're like, you're just, you're just chaos. Yeah. This is nuts. Just like you yeah. just, you just tried to, to um. Now, what are you, a slanish lover? Yeah, exactly. You're like everything pretty and you happy. You just tried to flay me alive. Yeah. You really need to lecture me while you're doing it. Oh wait, right. that's right. You're the dark god. You do. Yeah. 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 No wonder Du Bois hates space imperials. <sighs> yep. Oh yep. Okay. So. Indeed, Gary. I, Indeed, he do. Shot with this, ha, ha No wonder the boys hate space imperials. Yeah. 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 Okay. So I shot with that guy. Did nothing. Mm -hmm. Shot with these guys. Did you? nothing. Oh, well, marker right. lights. Oh, that's right. I was yeah, like, yeah. wait a minute. Yeah. yeah. Um, shot with these guys. Can you reach guys? me? Because you definitely should try and kill me. Why would I try? What? But I can only <laughs> shoot one weapon at a time. Oh, they all fired marker lights. Yeah. 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 Oh, my bad. I didn't yeah, think yeah. that was how marker lights work. It's not, but um, sorry. I always feel like I have something crawling That's up fine. my leg, and I don't. Yeah. Um, You're probably having a stroke. Let's finish the stream first. Okay, let's, let's, do, let's, let's finish this up. So we'll say your turn, <laughs> your next turn will be the last turn, but, but... No, I was just kidding about you, like, having a stroke. I was just making fun oh, of you okay. being itchy. No, well, I don't mind finishing, um, finishing early or finishing up the game. Oh, okay. Um, well, well, actually, we're going to go one more turn. Okay. And, uh, you know, maybe, maybe, like I said, you could do some examples of shooting sure. these guys sure. with some big guns. Sure. Okay. And a maybe, good charge, yeah. maybe we should do, yeah, maybe actually, 
Maybe, and then maybe after that yeah. we can do a charge and we can go Dope. through melee. Dope. Okay. So that's cool, and we'll when that'll be a, 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 an example, and then at some point we should get psychers. Totally. No, I have psychers. I just didn't play them. Okay, I don't have psychers. <laughs> you have none. You no. are psychically null. Uh, I like to say psychically. I can't say that word. Nope. On stream. Not at all. Not even close. No. Mm -hmm. Your turn. <laughs> Your turn. Go ahead. <laughs> I can't even say that word on stream. Go ahead. Your turn. <gasps> I'm gonna have some coffee. Indeedy doodle. Ah oh, man, you know what I really feel like having right now? Like a donut, but that that'd be bad. Yeah. Mm. Go ahead, sir. Yeah, it's a stigmatizing thing to sit on, to have to sit on. Yeah, I know. Yeah, right? absolutely. All absolutely. Right. Okay. So, uh, so yeah, so now it is Steven's turn two. Or, yeah, we're on Deuces. turn two. Okay. Deuces. All right, so Deuces. the Tau army has lasted two turns. I mean, you know, not bad for missing absolutely everything. They didn't miss everything. They missed no. and then failed to hit. Yeah, absolutely. they failed to Every, wound. They failed yeah, yeah, to yeah, wound they failed yeah. to wound anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And I think... The next time, um, I'm going to bring uh, more anti-tank stuff to make it a little more even here. Uh, um, bring more missile launchers, more fusion blasters. Yeah, you? missile launchers and fusion blasters seem to be the bee's knees against uh, uh, armor. Um, and your armor seems to be the bee's knees against pretty much everything else. Everything else. Um, although, actually, you know, it's interesting with these tanks, you know, what are these? These are the big bolters? No, what Heavy are bolters, yeah. Heavy bolters. So those, like... These Earth. big guns here are kind of good for... I don't want to poke it while he's Go moving. Go for it. Um, these big guns are good for, like, big targets like that dude. Or if I had a tank or something. Um, the LAS cannon's pretty pretty good for that sort of thing, but more oh for, like... Oh, my God, yes. Yeah, yeah. Is it? For no. taking out the big guys, yeah. Oh, yeah. And it, is that Melta as well? No. No, no, no. no but no, it's, no. it's good for taking out the big guys. Oh, yeah. But these heavy bolters are good for taking out, like, medium targets. Like, a, a unit of medium yeah, targets. Yeah, definitely. So... You know, each weapon seems to have, like, for example, these plasma rifles or pulse rifles or whatever, the pulse rifles, these are good against other infantry. But as you saw against the tank, it's no good against tankage. Tankage. Not at all. Not at all. So um, when you're shooting at, a, at, at different units, it, it's really important to not do what I did. Although, you know, like I said, I did actually do somewhat of a good thing. I just didn't roll well. Um, but... You want to really pay attention to the weapon you have. That's important. So what weapons your units have or your vehicles or whatever, monsters, if you will. Um, and oh, you I want will. to um, I will. go for sure. And what you're shooting at or what you're attacking, right? So, for example, like, again, you know, tanks should be shot at with something that does lots of damage. Lots of damage. To one unit or to one model, right? Not only one unit, but mm. one model. And I and I think that's because, like, for example, if you roll two d six, right? For two, or let's say you roll a d six for damage, right? Mm -hmm. That's still only going to affect one model in a unit. It doesn't actually spill over into the other guys of that unit, right? So, like, you know, you attack a unit, you attack on a unit by unit basis. If you run out of, uh, if you kill all the models in a unit, there, it doesn't spill over to other units. But if you kill a, a particular model in a unit, then it spills over. That really? I heard damage does not spill over. I will double check. That yeah, might have yeah, been, yeah. that might, yeah. I, I, I've From been told I, I'm human, and that yeah. means that I can make mistakes. Because one wound is when you hit, and then when you roll for damage, that's the number of damages that wound does. Right, 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 right. And so I don't think it's spilled, but there are there are forms there are, of damage that yeah. does actually spill over. Totally. So you have to pay attention totally. because sometimes it'll say no. Actually, this particular instance, it's going to spill over. Right, right, right. Um, I think smite might actually be one of those types of I deals. I think it is, yeah. Um, um, which actually, every psyker has smite, so you know that's pretty cool. Yeah, smite's very powerful. And if you're someone like the Grey Knights, every model has smite. They're all psykers. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, gray knights. Not yeah. to be mistaken for the Knights of Knee. No, nor, nor the brown knights. You know, the guys who clean up the staples at uh, Medieval Times. That's true, yep. the brown knights. Oh, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, yeah. So, according to this, the damage inflicted is equal to the damage characteristic of the weapon in the attack. If a model loses one wound for each point of damage, it's a model loses one wound for each point of damage. If a model's wounds are reduced to zero, it is either slain or destroyed and removed from play. If a model loses several wounds from a single attack and is destroyed, any excess damage is lost. You were right and I was there wrong. There you go. You there were you right go. and I was wrong. There you go. Oh, indeed, it'll do. So, but that's, that's good. We're reviewing. 
We're reviewing. Oh, yeah. That's that's yeah. the whole point. We're no, that's that's something you learn real quick yeah. being a game master is that you and I'm not trying to toot my own horn like that. that that's that's the culture. <laughs> cult. I'm sorry. Go ahead. If I could actually <laughs> toot my own horn, I wouldn't be here right now to to entertain you. You would be also, much yeah. more pale, and you would have never left the house in the first place. It's, that's absolutely true. Alrighty. Yeah, me and Steve Bannon allegedly. <laughs> um, so um uh yeah um the that's that's the colloquialism in our in culture is you know the game master you don't get a chance to play as much as lead so I end up making those kinds of mistakes. Well, hey, so now you, you get to play at me. least once a week. I know, it's great. No, yeah. that's yeah. I'm totally totally shameless plug. Um, that's one of the reasons why we started the show, which is just I get a chance to play games more. I feel like you're yeah. using me. That's all right. That's all right. You're using. Not at all. She's gonna throw me on the table and no. just have your way with you me. You can be replaced. That's if fine. That's, what you're after. that's fine. <laughs> wow. Wow. All right. So you moved those two tanks. I moved. You these moved two those tanks. Dudes. I moved those guys. Um, I don't think these I'm guys? gonna. I mean, you can move them if. You... Oh, actually, can you do me a favor? A flavor. Can you yeah. move them and then make them move further? Yeah. Like make them run. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Yes, cool, indeed. Cool, cool. That's Let's called advancing. That. Okay. Everyone's house rule became the official rule, which is just just roll before. You used to have to advance in a different phase, which is really stupid. But um, because the way it works is you roll a d6, I just rolled a 4. You roll a d6, and now you just add that to your movement. So instead of moving 5 inches, hold on, let me stop and do it all yeah, over yeah, again. Yeah. Yeah, I'm yeah. just going to move 9 inches yeah, all in yeah. one shot. Yeah. Now, I can see where that would be actually kind of confusing, only in a sense of, oh, did I actually run these guys? Yeah. You know, like that's why you probably, at first, oh, yeah. you might want to follow the steps first mm -hmm. so you can keep track of what has happened. But, you know, when you become super pros. Super you know, pros. And when you're you, shoving you, pros into their you, lockers because you're super pros. You know, and yeah. uh, you, you put down a bunch of crisis suits and they get vaporized turn one. Um, <laughs> you know, then you can kind of skip that sort of thing. So, um, and just get right to the, get straight to the biscuits, as they say, right? So. A jerk. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm pretending this little tap. You know what? No, never mind. Never mind. Is there. Right. Right. Well, I mean, you know, do as you wish. I'm not worried. This is this game is was over turn one and a, one and a half, so we're good. <laughs> oh, you know what I should have done? I should have cheated. Darn it! This is why I forget. You know, guys, when it comes down to it, nothing, nothing really, really seems nothing to really matters. Nothing really matters. Um, no one belongs anywhere. None of us have a purpose. Can you please yeah, just come no one exists on and purpose. Sit down and watch Ugh. TV with us. Um, please do. So yeah, but that's pretty cool, right? We got we got new rules, whole new Warhammer game. It feels like to me. Yeah. No, um, seriously. You know, I think. Wow, this thing's unwieldy. Yeah. We're moving pretty quick. Yeah. Um, it it's helped that um you know we've we've. We've uh, we both somewhat know what we're doing. Like I somewhat yeah. know he knows more uh, as the, as the as as okay. experience goes. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I think we're doing pretty good. Yep, yep, yep. Got a Thank you, Garyan. Garyan, smiley faces Garians. keep Garians. us going. We all work for stickers and smiley faces. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Garyans, are you Garyan? No, 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 oh. no. Garyan's a totally different dude. I'm so sorry. I yeah. thought that a lot of our we have another regular called Garyan. And um, I, a, a lot of people going from Twitch to like Discord will will slightly vary their name. Yeah, so yeah, if yeah. you are not that person, I apologize. I totally thought that you were no, the same, no same guy. The same think, commentator. I, so. I apologize, yeah. Garyans. Yeah. I apologize. Yeah. Cool. To make up for it, um, I'm gonna start blasting away at you. Blasting Yay. away at you, real, real good. Alrighty. Let's um, do it. Yeah. Um, first things first. I'm gonna fire. Uh, my lead Lehman Russ at these guys. All right. Um, so that's um, it's going to be heavy D6 for the battle cannon. Um, for oh, you might have noticed that I'm not measuring. Uh, it's because these two weapons have the uh, a range the same as 16? the entire 16 table. Inches, right? 72 inches. 72 inches. Yeah. So like you're you're we're supposed to measure. I it, they're in range. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Cool. So um, I just rolled a six to see how many times I get to fire and rolled a what did I roll? I rolled a six, didn't I? You no, know I'm gonna no, I, think you I rolled, rolled a four. four. Yeah. You rolled cool. a four. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. You want to re-roll in case, just to be fair, because we both don't remember. I feel like that's good gamesmanship. I'll just oh, re-roll. Okay. Yeah, sure, sure. I mean, yeah. No, one. no, okay. no, 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 yeah, not a one. Roll again. <laughs> you had more than one last. Time. Okay. That's BS. There's four. four. It's a four again. Yeah, it's okay, a four so again. There we go. That's better. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I, because I know it was more than one. I'm not gonna make yeah. a re-roll and go. Okay, I appreciate one. that. Yeah, thank that's, you, man. That's silly pants. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. Oh, he says he is everywhere, and on Discord he is Garyan. On oh. Twitter, Garyan's. 
Yeah, I thought I heard that somewhere. Oh, I, okay. I, I, thought, I thought I heard, yeah, someone was oh, telling so me. So it was Discord person. that he was Garion, and these yeah. Garion's here. So the only okay, yeah, cool, yeah, yeah. cool, cool, cool. I'm sorry, man. Yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah. no, no thank actually, you for being so on top of it. All right. Because that's the kind of mistake I would totally make, which is just assuming they're the same person. Yeah, actually, you know, so we, got, you. we got Discord going. That's actually the best way to get in contact with us. Um, and just to hang out and chat with us is on Discord. Are you in Discord for us, with us? I am. I haven't posted in a while. I'm totally on Discord. Okay. Yeah. Cool. No, no, I need to get, um, yeah, I got yeah, my yeah. free time back, man. I'm doing all kinds of cool stuff that I didn't get a chance to. And being but more not being on Discord on, is, yeah. is one of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Get, get your butt on Discord. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Discord, I've, yeah. I've spent more time on Discord, actually. Super cool. Yeah, yeah I yeah. noticed. It's very cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, anyway, so what are we doing? Yes, indeed, you doodle. Uh, I'm trying to wound me? The battle can yeah. Okay, so it'll be a two up. I'm just going to say that. So two <laughs> that'll up. It'll be four up to hit. Four ups to hit? Four up to hit. Um, wow. All right, so two. So two. So right. these are going to be to wound. What's your, um, what's your toughness? Three. Okay, so I'm at strength eight. Okay, so it's two better to wound. Oh, okay. that's what you meant. Yeah. So, both wounds. so um, it's going to be, and it's damage uh, D3. Um, so, so six. So 12. So I uh, roll six saves, and if you, uh, but I. Um, oh, I no, can no, no. No, no, no. Remember, I only do two. Because really, these are the damage. Yeah. Remember? Damage doesn't spill over. So you can only right. hit two models. Yeah. No, no, no. But I mean, I, I think it's funny that 12 damage goes into two guys. No, it does. Yeah, no, no. I just so, but I only have, but I have to roll like a five up or something. So yeah, you're yeah, all yeah. good. You're all good. Oh, no. It's, that was, it's remember, that was the, that's no, the example we're giving. Exactly. You no, just no, no. blew all this no, stuff I, at me, and they're just like, two guys died. Yeah, no. So clearly, this weapon is not meant for a lot of Exactly. Units. Okay. No, they're engulfed. No, that's, right. that, you're exactly right. Really big, powerful single cannons and stuff like that got worse in this game. They're still effective, but they got measurably worse. Yeah, they're specifically effective. Exactly. Like, you have to be specifically, you have mm -hmm. to use them specifically for Definitely. that particular target. Because if you don't, you're just wasting, you're wasting your, your shots, man. Exactly so. Just, I do think it's very funny, though, that the 12 goo. damage goes into potentially even just one guy. So, yeah, they were like, tough for three. Soup. I know, right? Um, but save is four up. So, I think two guys your just save get vaporized. was four up. Yeah, because my, I'm a, oh, no, I'm AP minus two. I thought it was AP minus oh, three. Oh, so it's six. Yeah, so you all can right, save. So I two sixes, which I may or may not do. Nope. I did not. Close, though. Two fives. Mm -hmm. So two guys die. Now, do I have to pick the closest guy? You do not. Really? Yeah. In this game, it, it feels really unnatural at first, but it works out really... I'm so happy about this. Um, you get to choose whoever you want to take the damage, including the guys right off the back. And the reason why I think that's so great is what we've all, you know, the, you and I and Gary and I have been talking about, yeah, yeah. which is it's part of the streamlining of the game, because mm -hmm. before it was you had to, and it kind of made sense, which is just that, well, this blob is shooting at this other of guys, is shooting at this blob of guys, bullets are going this way, you take out the closest guys. Mm -hmm. But it, it slowed the game down, because you would lose the front ranks of guys, which basically negated your movement as well as took guys away. Now that you have the option to take guys out of the back, the unit's still advancing at that steady rate. So mm. you're still suffering losses, mm. but you're not. You're you're keeping the game going at the same speed. Mm. The, you know, because before you would literally slow the game down as you would start hurting your opponent mm -hmm. by just removing the front rank, because that's where you'd measure from. Right, right, right. So the one exception to that is if someone, if a model in the unit has already lost a wound, like it's a multi-wound unit, right, multi-wound right. model, um, you have to allocate wounds to it until it dies or gets healed right. or something like that. And then you move on to the next. Right. But oh. you have no such guys, so you get no. to choose who's dead. All right, so these guys, cool. they're dead. Wish. Cool. Alrighty. Cool. So Garion says, the only reason you would measure is if you're attacking from the corners. That's not a rule, but it's the way that things worked out here, is that I happen to have, we both brought a bunch of long-range weapons. So yeah, that's the only reason for us uh, in this game to do that, is from the corners. Hmm. Um, special edition? Everything's a special edition that we make here at Mint Potion. Mm. We're all special. Hmm. Indeed he do. Mm. Okay, so now this guy's going to shoot. I okay. placed him badly, so uh, I'm going to definitely shoot at... Um, oh, my knees. Oh, so now you, you, can't, you can't shoot? Like they're, they're, if they were in the same unit, they could. They're not in the same oh. unit. So that rule stayed the same, which is that if you are... Um, you can um, fire through your own uh, friendly models. You know, that represents micromanaging, just like, no jerk, go to your left. No, yeah. your other left. And so you can fire through models in the same unit, but... Um, uh, these guys, these, these two are not in the same unit. So that's actually the, my advantage, except for in this specific case. So, um, I, and I totally brain farted, no. to use the psychiatric oh. term, I totally brain farted mm -hmm. on, um, uh, placing him. So only this gun's going to be able to reach, but I'm going to fire, um, at his ghost kill. So same deal. I'm going to do D6 to see how many, um, how many hits I get to make, and I rolled five. 
two, four, five. Does he have some marker light nonsense or some kind of like um Oh homeboy here? Homeboy, yes. Yeah, he has the he has that um that electro warfare suite, so you get negative one to your ballistic skill for shooting at him. Okay, cool. Yeah. yeah. Ooh crap. Correa. Or wow. negative one to your ballistic skill after, after you shot. You shoot. Yeah, yeah after okay. Shot um and his BS is three. Uh so three up. Um So those hit. No, no, these these hit. These hit. Yeah, those, yeah, those, yeah, those yeah. exactly. Yeah, oh, yeah. Cool. All right. Um, so your toughness is six, right? Uh, gee, I don't know. Does that change? That oh, doesn't change. Uh, does it, it might. What what changes? I thought that was really interesting. What what degrades when big units start taking hits? Uh, varies from unit to unit. So um, it's almost always movement, but sometimes yeah, it's movement. not. It's movement. So his toughness is six. It's still six after hurting him. Uh oh no 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 yeah it is it is okay yeah because it's it's usually yeah. tough yeah. Yeah. Too. Yeah. um so yeah um so it's six and my strength is eight um wow so they all hit no yeah they all wound yeah 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 they all wound yeah, 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 so yeah they yeah. all wound and the damage is going to be um d three so three nine cool wow okay so I have to roll three well wait three, a minute six. what's your what's your a ap uh minus two okay so he's dead. He's dead. Yeah, he's dead. Now, does, does he ghost explode? Kill. No, he wouldn't, right? Well, I don't know. Would um, he? No, I think that's vehicles only. Salvation. Vehicles would actually um, actually do splash damage when they die, oh. um, much like they used to. Oh, you know what? I totally forgot the about the ghost kill. What's up? He has to mandatorily come with drones. Next time. Yeah, next time, for we're sure. going to bring drones. But for right now, mm -hmm. he's toast. Toasty, cool. toasty robot. There we go. So yeah. I like my toast. So just robots. so you know, guys, I screwed up a little bit there. He's supposed to have drones. Pardon I didn't me. bring drones. Oh, well. <laughs> Next time. This first game, we're going to be as chill as possible. Absolutely. Yeah, the only thing we're going to try at is try... No, we're obviously going to try and get the game right and play mm. and entertain you all. Mm -hmm. But no, I was going to say the only thing we're going to try to do is try and chill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, speaking of chill, I'm going to murder your face some more. Okay. Yeah. Um, so, this guy shooting in them. Right. So, um, uh, the demolisher can's a little different. I just want to uh, make sure I get that right, so I'm actually going to look at it again. Okay. Yeah. Um, the demolisher cannon is... Uh, it's heavy D3. That's right. It's not heavy D6. It's heavy D3. But when I'm firing at a unit that's got five or more models, um, it changes to heavy D6. Um, so you've got, um, yeah, it says five or more. So you have six there. So it's going to be D6 again. Um, and I rolled four. Four. Okay. So that's four, four. shots. Yeah. And now All they're right. the ones using the marker light. So they don't have, they don't get the benefit themselves, do they? No. Well, okay. I mean, they do, but I mean, it, it would be like, they do, but that's not important. Okay. Right oh, now. it's it's them shooting me, not me shooting them. Right, right, okay, right. Okay, cool. Right. So, um... Yeah, it's going to be four up to hit. Uh, all but one. All okay. but one. Um, and this is strength 10. You're not toughness five, nope. are you? Okay. So it's going to be um, two or better to wound. Um, and they all wound. Okay. Um, and the damage is D6, but I do want to double check to make sure I'm doing it right. Yep, damage is D6. Oh, oh well, it won't one. matter. One, one, one. It's not going to matter. Crap. Why? Because I just take three guys and I make... Because you already hit three guys. Yeah. And since damage doesn't spill over, mm -hmm. I'm just going to take those three guys and put them over there. Okay, cool. Okay, well, cool. you just have to roll your saves. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, no, because yeah. their save is five up. Oh, yeah. No, yeah, never yeah, mind. Yeah, yeah, they yeah, can yeah. negative three. I assume, nice. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I assume that that's just going to penetrate their that's, clothing. That's, that's a, yeah. solid, that's a yeah. solid bet. Yeah. yeah, no, it's it's very funny. Those models are, they did a really good job with, like, the Tau regular infantry mm. to model them, make it seem like they have really naturally fitting, like, really well-designed armor. So it kind of yeah. just looks like clothing with plates in it. And then, like, those Pathfinders or the light special forces, they, they're just wearing clothes. Yikes. Like, they're, they're just out there in their khakis. Yeah, basically. Yeah, they're like, like Preston and I just out there. You're like, you, like yeah. you, you get your khakis yeah. and your blue. Yeah. You're a, you're a towel. Basically. You're a towel, man. You know, we love the Golden Girls. You're That's a towel. Work. Yeah, absolutely. Oh. All right. That's their, who leads their culture, are the yeah. Golden Girls. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, so now you got a last cannon. You want to throw the last cannon I do. Cannon That's exactly right. what all I right. want to do. All right. Um, so I believe that's um, a heavy one weapon, but I want to make sure I do this right for you. Yep, it's heavy one. Oh. So four better to hit. Do not oh, hit. Oh, it doesn't hit. Dun, dun, dun. All right. Well, you know, I'm, I'm actually kind of exhausted. You want to call it? I think, I think, I think yeah. I'm ready, but, but, but cool. let's go through... Um, is there anything else in your turn that you wanted to go and shoot? No, after? I thought for sure I'd be able to. Um, I wouldn't. I would not be able to kill the ghost to heal in one hit. So I built everything around having shots to. Oh crap! I almost dropped the thing. Right. Oh my goodness! I can. I can totally shoot those guys. Okay, we'll shoot those. Cool. Yeah. Um, and then you want to call it after that, or do you want to demo anything else? Um, I'm I'm okay. Like I I'm, I actually kind of want to sit down. You got it. Um, so cool. If you're not feeling shoot, well, shoot at him. Yeah. And then well, let's go over what happened. Sure. 
So, what's going to happen is, before um, I was firing rapid fire weapons, which meant I would get double the shots if I was in half range of the target, and I was when the big robot was there, but I already killed him. Hmm. So now, um, it's just one shot from everybody. Um, and I was close enough to use the sergeant's pistol. He's got a he's got a chain sword, um, which is exactly what it sounds like, a chainsaw with a Colton pommel, yeah. um, uh, but the, that and a pistol, but that's out of range. So I'm going to do nine, or I'm sorry, not nine shots. Six shots. Six shots. Um, and then um, I have my grenade launchers. But we'll okay. start with the um, the regular old um, um, laser guns. Uh, cool. So that's, which is the stock weapon. Yeah. Three are better to hit, because they are veterans. Cool, three hits. All right. Cool. Three All hits. Right. And then it's strength three against, what's your toughness? I believe toughness it's three. Toughness three. Yeah, four cool. ups. Four up. Uh, two hit. Okay. Cool. And do you have an AP on that? No, AP okay. nothing. So it's going to so be four ups with these guys. Up. Oh, that's right. You have four ups. Saves. And one guy dies, one guy and one guy down. survives. So I'm going to take cool. another guy off the back. Sweet. All right. Um, and I am going to now fire my, my missile launchers. Now, I, I'm sorry, <laughs> my missile launchers. I'm hiding them all the time. Mm. Um, um, uh, but no, my grenade launcher. Tradition, grenade. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Forgive the bit of dead air. I just want to make sure they do this absolutely No, no, right no, it's okay. Yeah. Um, while he's doing that, um, I, can, I can also look at my phone and not pay cool. attention to the stream. <laughs> look at that. So it's going to be um, D6. D6, okay. So yeah. one, one. Oh, that's right. Number of shots. So four. Yeah. So you have four shots, mm -hmm. right? Okay. Actually, it's going to be because um, I have three different weapons that are doing it. So four for one. Okay. Um, four, four for, for another. another. And, and four, four for another. another. That was okay. easy. Yeah. So All it's right. going to be um, three or better to hit. Well, get, wait, yeah. wait, wait. Don't you have to do 12? Um, right, you are. Sorry, that's not damage. That, yeah, good catch. Okay. Three. I just want to make that sure. No, you're right, because okay. that was the weapon type, which means number of shots to hit, not right. the damage I do. Right, right. Um, cool, cool. Cool. Yeah. Super cool. Four times three is 12. We're good. So now it's three or better. All right. Oh, boy. That's, that's um, a bit that's, of a mixed bag there. That's a very mixed bag. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, yeah. six hits. It looks like if I'm counting correctly. Yep. Cool. Man. So half. That's not terrible. Yeah. So one, it's maybe going one to more, be but cool. um, uh, four or better to wound because it's three to three. So oh, four. Oh really? Up. Yep. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Yep. All right. And now is there an AP on this? Uh, there is not. So go ahead and take your saves. All right. Sir. So we're gonna do four, mm -hmm. four ups here. We're gonna do well, actually five four ups, but four ups. We survive three and two more dudes die. Cool. So we're gonna take those dudes. They're gone. Dun dun dun. Bum, 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 bum. Cool. Alrighty. Cool. So now, now is that everybody? That's everybody. But that brings us to the morale phase, which is very, right. which is new. This is very and interesting. Very, yes. very important. So now I'm down to seven guys. You are I down started to seven with guys. Yeah. So the way this now works is, um, you're gonna roll a d6, okay. and you're gonna add that to the number of men that you lost. All right. Or Lady Taos that you lost. Okay, or, so or I've lost you, five, yeah. plus one is six. Okay. Okay, and then I have to check my morale, right? Yeah, if it if it exceeds the highest leadership characteristic. You don't have a, a sergeant, like a Shasui or whatever. Uh, yeah, okay, but cool. whatever, let's let's see what happens. I yeah. don't think it'll so matter. So that's going to be, we'll, we'll oh, he should have one higher leadership, so that would make a difference. Oh, that is, does make a difference. Yeah. Right. No, in this game, if you have one higher, uh, if you have used the highest leadership for this specific mechanic, which is um, um, to see um, how many additional losses you suffer. So if you have someone like a sergeant type of character. So it's six, okay. and the default leadership is six, okay. but the leadership of the Shaz we is seven. So let's say it's six. Do I lose any guys? Um, you do. You rolled seven, correct? You rolled your... Um, well, see, I have six guys that lost, and I have one, so it's a seven, yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, so let's so say it's that a six. Means no, no, let's say that, let's okay. say, let's Definitely. say, let's Sorry, say that my leadership is a six. Okay, yeah, so yeah. now what do I do? Cool. So, um, that means that you lose, so your leadership is, um, is a six, and you rolled a one. Um, Which makes seven. I'm sorry, how many guys did you lose? You lost. Oh, um, I lost, uh, I lost uh, six guys. <laughs> so I lost six guys. Let's see what now, so it's now it's seven. So seven. what happens? So you lose an additional guy. I lose one more guy. You lose one more Automatically. guy. Automatically. Okay, no so matter this guy's what. gone. All yep. right. Yeah, so the way that that's, that, um, just to review really quickly, um, you take the number of models you lost, mm -hmm. roll a d6, mm -hmm. and compare the number to your leadership. Mm -hmm. If that number is greater than your leadership, mm -hmm. you lose the difference. Oh. So if you've got leadership 7, you lost 5 guys, roll to 5. 
um, that's ten. You lose three additional guns. Three dudes. Okay. Yeah. All right. Three it dudes. It sounds gone. much more complicated than it is. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's harder to describe than to do. Definitely. Oh, okay. Okay. Cool. So that's how that would work. Yep. I would roll. I would take my the number of dudes that died. And we said it was seven. Yes. Right. I roll. Okay, it's a five. That means my leadership is six. That means I would lose a total of uh, six guys. My leadership was six. Indeed, you Interesting. Well, that's, you know, that's actually a little easier because then I don't have yeah. to run back and then run back yeah, and then run exactly. back. Yeah, exactly. Because before, back. you would have to move them and test and then move them and test right. and then either recoup and then try and make them useful Yeah. or they just die. Yeah, they run off the table. Yeah, so this, yeah. I think, is actually way more... Uh, the math it feels really unnatural, but it doesn't require moving and losing guys. That's Just true. losing them or keeping them. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'd rather do math than have to move dudes aimlessly. A lot of work has gone into making this game more streamlined. I think they're definitely successful. Very Thank cool. you for our first for our first uh, ever episode of Paradise. I can't yeah. tell you how much it means to me. Thank you very much. Here, you I'm gonna get to, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lift the camera so they can yeah. see our beautiful faces. Yeah, we're no longer the headless horseman, although that's yeah. a cool Let's nickname. See, I'm do this. We're going to go back to our second show. It's like, like, who are these it's guys? It's like the Lone Rangers, right? Who are these guys? They're, they're lone, how are they alone if, they're, if it's plural? Um, <laughs> sorry, it's an old movie. All right, so yeah, that was, Thank you that was pretty cool. I think, we, I think we set it up decent. We'll, we'll probably have to do more camera work. Yeah. At some point, we're actually going to... At some point, we're actually not going to be in what is the tracking room. Mm -hmm. um, so we're going to move to all another in the future. room. But that's in the future. Yeah. So for right now, if you could just kind of put up <laughs> with this, with this bit of nonsense, um, we're growing. We're uh, learning. We might put something back here, but as you can see, the it's so far back that yeah. Um, it's and all then in the future, though, we might have we might have like you know Ben or Jake or Robbie yeah. or somebody if they're making music or something that that we can share, right? Because sometimes we can't share all the music, but we, uh, if they want, <laughs> they make something they want to oh share, my, no. then we might have that playing as well. Um, so that's pretty dope, right? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's pretty dope. So uh, anyway, yeah. um, that's kind of how that's going. Um, sorry, I just I was just I had a really kind of Don't a weird apologize. healthy yeah. health day. So no, no. Um, he's a trooper for for getting the show done. Yeah. I'm I'm trying. So You're succeeding. That was great. Thank you very yeah. much. Thank um, you, everyone. We're just gonna build it up from here. We've got tons of plans. You're gonna be here with us, and we can't wait. So thank yeah. you. Thank you. Have a good one. I'm gonna Alrighty go to then. the Tricaster room just in case. Excellent. There. We'll see you next week. Every Wednesday, Paradise. And thank you, Garyan, and all of our other regulars watching us. Um, we couldn't do it without you, so thank you. All right. Uh, let me see here. Where is this thing? You stay golden. There we go.